took a, took the game a second there. And to start off, we've got Mr. Bear here too. Okay, uh, where's my game? Display capture, there we go. Welcome everybody back to, well, yeah, this is only day number two, so we'll go with back to Rule of Waves 2. As China always got his per box going too, always a happy little man to be sitting in a lap. So, we are going to be um, rebuilding and hopefully decommissioning most of the Legacy fleet today. Now, somebody asked uh, before we started about um, settings. Uh, China, 30% tech rate, massive fleet size, reduced uh, air development speed, and varied tech. Now, varied tech, that was a question again. Uh, varied tech basically means that um, there are some technologies that will not necessarily fire in historical order and may not necessarily be historically accurate in terms of feasibility yet. No BBs? No, no, we're, we're we might not see BBs until next stream or the one We after. love you! Shut sure, up, baby, I know it! 30% tech rate, so it's going to be massively delayed. Um, so, for instance, with varied tech rate, uh, cross deck fire might fire early and be more and and last longer because, uh, like, having more uh, centerline gun mounts might not fire till later. So that might be a more viable tech. Torpedoes might turn out to be complete duds. Like the torpedo technology might not fi uh, fire for a while, so light forces might be hamstrung. So varied technology changes things up like that. And my god, this little man. Oh, he's so big and handsome. He's so happy. Listen to this. Listen to that. Do we have wing turrets? I don't even think we have wing turrets yet. Uh, we have basically nothing just just, just as of yet. And so I just saw somebody did say, uh, did, we, did Japan own us yet? No, I actually, in the first war, I owned Japan. Um, I took, I, I took um, Formosa and Hokkaido from Japan in the first war, and managed to actually spread my superior Chinese empire across the area a little bit more. So we had a, we had it was a long, painful, boring war, but we ha but we did have a successful first war. Um, and right now, the mainstay of our fleet are these right here: the Cyrus Ho. Class, 17 and a half thousand tons, rated for 19 knots, pre-dreadnoughts, and Stotch Master, welcome, welcome. Uh, we we license built all of these in the U.S., I believe it was. Uh, and for a pre-dreadnought, they're actually pretty good. Um, pretty, pretty prickly armed. Uh, they don't have, like, massive guns because pre-dreadnoughts rarely hit with their primary uh, caliber weapons. Um, a lot of times those are duds. And even if they do, uh, do explode, the, the shells just might not be that effective because they don't have high penetration values. Um, but they do have um, outsized secondary and decent um, tertiary batteries. So they're pretty effective and they're better than the legacy uh, ships that we started out with. Um, I don't remember what caliber of guns we have access to right now. China starts with only, like, I think it was only low quality 8 inch guns. But, oh, I forgot about this. We got, uh, we researched high quality six inch guns. Six inch guns, in my opinion, is one of the most important calibers in the game because those can be primaries on lots of smaller classes of ships and secondaries on all your big ships. So six inch guns, and they can be dual purpose guns later on. Six inch guns are very important. We got high quality six inch guns. Um, looks like we got access to tens low quality tens and low quality 12s as well that's good two inch gun challenge um i actually never use the twos and rarely use the threes but uh four four fives and sixes get used extensively i find myself very rarely using the sevens outside of pre-dreadnoughts as well but anywho uh, everybody's still on active fleet so we're going to reserve them to save some cash i'm going to keep um how much is it going to cost me Double. I'm going to keep three of the Cyruses on active fleet um, to keep their crews up. And 
and I don't want I want to start getting rid of the legacy ships I hate the legacy ships, the legacy ships generally but right now we're not in a position to really do that uh, we can build better destroyers too because we did get access to 600 ton destroyers but right now I don't think we're probably well how much cash we got 50 56 We can build everything up to heavy cruisers right now of decent size. I think for now I'll just wait a few months and see if anything else pops. Great Britain is refreighting their cruisers with heavier guns. Interesting. Oh, am I building anything right now? Corvettes out the wazoo. Okay, that's where a lot of my budget's going right now, is we're building two dozen Corvettes. Game's a little laggy today, actually. Slump in the economy has led to widespread unemployment and poverty. Uh, we'll do we'll do social reforms. I have no idea if going with social reforms actually has any impact on the game. I've been told it does, but I don't know if that's true or not. Honestly, uh, okay, so we'll go with it. So this reforms pass. We're going from 143. We love I you. Like yeah, baby, painful. I know it. Brazil. Thanks for the read, Italy. Well, actually, it wasn't bad. Uh, actually, we only lost about what three grand or so. Uh, close to mastering active mine warfare. Game is definitely a little laggy today for some reason, but it's not that bad. Like it, it takes a second to process the turn. Never seen it take more than a second to process a turn, but whatever. As long as the game's still working. How low can your prestige get before problems? Uh, less than 20 is where you're going to run into issues. 13,000. Oh, God. It's so painful. It's so painful. Um, armored cruisers. We need better armored cruisers. These are the ones we purpose-built and kind of suck. Um, these are the ones we started with and kind of suck. The problem is they're all slow as shit. Except for these ones, they're a little bit zippier. They're too slow. My light cruisers are no good either, really. Reduced your unrest by two points to zero. Oh, I didn't even notice that. Uh, the British are offered to sell us the rights to range calculators. Yes, I will take that. That's a, that's a um, accuracy improvement. I really might just sit on the extra. No, I can't sit on the extra. I, I my budget's so low. I can't sit on the extra funds for too long. Um, oh man, this is part of the problems with uh, China too, is there's always construction delays. Look at, these were all started on the same month. Look at this, look at this. They're all, they're like all different, different stages of completion, it's terrible. Oh, that's unfortunate. Um, This is the best class we have right now for Armored Cruiser. So we might be able to build an improved class off of this one and save ourselves some money. Has to be built in Germany. Uh, how much bigger can we make it? 14,000 tons is not a problem. Um, can I get 23 knots? I get 24 knots out of it without too much issue. Do they have better guns yet? Uh, no, they don't. Oh, wait, if I go to 24 knots, it's not built off of the same class. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Um, we'll add on more mounts that we like to have. I'm gonna go with the quality. Oh, Germany doesn't have the quality one six inch guns. I, so what I could do is I could build these in Germany and then ship them home and it improve the, the, the secondaries there. That's something I could do. Um, we can lose these. I really would like 24 knots out of it, but that would make it not developed off of the class. Historical Gamer! China, Oye. Yeah. Yeah, I know. China's the shittiest nation in the game, but uh, that's what people wanted to see. All right, now. Oh, yeah, you know what? I'm not going to make this, I'm not going to be able to make this developed from class. Um, 
Not without... Oh, God. Like, like the deck extended being only one and a half is... Shit. Add the thingy that the, Br the British sold you. The thingy that the British sold me uh, is not an actual item to install on a ship. It's just a... It's just a slow increase in accuracy over time. It's not It's not a physical item to add on here. What is his name? Nautius Maximus. Uh... <laughs> By the way, your Starship Troopers announcements are sure timely. Given the new game and its gameplay revealed today. 4K? Uh, new Starship Troopers game? Excuse me? Baking powder? Hang on. I hope I hope we're not talking about something I thought Hang on. Um How do you go to your I don't remember how to go to your wish list. There it is. Wait, no, I think I took it off my wish list. Um What is his name? Nautius Maximus. I hope it's not this. Slytherin is making a game. They just showed gameplay today. I hope it's not this game because this game has been sitting on here for for like over a year now it's a slither game okay i i am gonna have to look it up then because i don't know i don't i don't know oh god should i look it up now should we look it up now no no we will i'll do it i'll do it later i'll do it. i'll look it up later i'll do it later i'll do it later okay um yeah so i don't think we're gonna end up developing this ship from from a class because there are improvements i would like to make that are significant that I'm not going to be able to do. Uh, so let's see if we can get better main guns out of it. Ooh, ooh, the Germans have plus one quality eight inch guns. Do it. That's sexy. Uh, yeah, might go with that. I actually think I might be able to put wing turrets on it that, well, let's see what Germany has. Um, port emit ship. I don't think we'll be able to do doubles. I think that's probably illegal. No, that's legal. It's called Starship Troopers Terran Command. Wait, wasn't that the one I just looked at? It's like cross deck is available. I don't think cross deck is available. That's that's always on. That's always there. Uh, actually didn't throw an error on that. Huh. What if we, uh... Starboard wing, port wing, G and J, I think is... Is that legal? Okay, it's not throwing... You're right, I think you're right about that. Link to the YouTube video. Yeah, no, this looks like that game. Are we sure? Uh. Uh. Yeah, no, that's, that's, that's the same game I was looking at. That's the same game, and this game looks like total shit. Yeah, that's that's the same one. And this and and this 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 game right here looks like total garbage. Um okay, uh yeah. Pwah, okay. Some conning tower armor. Some armor here and there. Uh can I get that twenty I can still get that twenty-four knots. Is this legal? I'm still perplexed that this is legal. Are we talking garbage or Dawn of War 3 garbage? I, I don't know if I go that far just yet. How do I not have a I will make it legal gift yet? Jesus Christ, I say that so much. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, this is a actually fairly schmexy armored cruiser here. <clears throat> uh, 
The turret armor is pretty low, but usually the turret armor on an armored cruiser is pretty low. Looks like a game that we would be love okay you. 10 years Shut ago. up, baby, I know I'm it. Gonna, pew pew. I'm gonna um have to take another look at it. Um last time I looked at that, it was like a year, a year and a half ago when it first went when that page first appeared on Steam. And I watched the videos and I looked at the pictures and I, I read over the information that was available because I fucking love Starship Troopers. And it all looked like utter trash. Um I I will it's been a while, so I will give it another look and see what do. And see what do. Uh, okay. How much do these weigh? A bit. A dozen per side's pretty good. No no quick firing guns. Um you mean like guns with auto loaders? <coughs> or what are we, what are we talking about? Like there are no quick fire guns in the game. Your your accuracy or in your your rate of fire can improve with technology, and then later on you could have auto loader guns. <coughs> Low caliber ones. Six inch guns are my low caliber guns. These guys aren't designed for de de fighting destroyers, so the six inch guns are the ones that'll have to do that. Uh, the six inch guns has plenty of hitting power and tracking ability to hit a destroyer, no issue. Carronades, oh yeah, Car we could always use more carronades. 32 pounders, 64 pounders if we're feeling saucy. And you all know me, I'm often saucy. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, okay, I was about to say, I'm not sure if I want to go for the 24 knots, but this is being built in Germany, so. Oh, you know what I can do to save weight? We can make these singles, and that'll save me a lot of weight for armor. And that's still more firepower than a ship would normally have at this stage in the game, at 30% tech rate. Um... Because I, I, there's a cup like like I'd like six inches on the armor. On, on the on the, the the regular turrets that would proof it pretty much again maybe even six and a half. Seven maybe even seven, seven uh, belt extended two, deck extended two, deck two duck deck extended two is good. Conning tower like a little bit more. Uh, how many secondaries can I have on there? Can I get, can I get 16? I can get 16. Can I get 18? I can get 18. That's, that's a little pricklier. And then, uh, fill it out with a little bit extra pew pew. Okay. I think, I think that's what we're going to go with. That's a, that's, that's a spicy meatball. And, uh, Enola. Okay, I can't hit it. I, apparently, I can't just hit enter. Okay. Ooh, um. That's fine. I was gonna, I was gonna alter the, the, the superstructure a little bit, like a couple of you guys mentioned, but no, it's too late now. It's fine. Ba doop, ba -doop. Is offering to sell us the rights to. Oh, what? Already? Do you even have multiple center lines? I I don't. That's why I'm like sh shocked. I expect advances in fleet tactics, active mine warfare, increased use of defensive fields. Um, 
I'm gonna build a pair of these in Germany. And I'm spying just on you. I'm gonna spy on the Americans for now. Rural economies recovered. Uh, 140 is gonna go up. 141. Hosting a international regatta and race. Our well-trained crew is the favorite to win. Go for the win. Hey, unexpected advances in armor too. Face hardening. Beautiful. Got a, I, well, right now I'm really waiting for those Corvettes. So three uh, medium wing turrets are available now. Secondary wing, uh, uh, wing, blah, blah, blah. It enables secondary wing double turrets up to 10 inches. Giggity. There's 10. It's been an er, upheaval in Albania. France is sending a force. Back down or else, France. For, okay, I wouldn't have been, I wouldn't have been impressed by that either. France is unimpressed by our ultimatum. Dostal subs, eh. I'm, I, yeah, no, there they go. That's fine. That's, 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 that's fine. There's some Corvettes. All right, now we have Corvettes at least. Yay, increased industrialization. Got about another five grand to work with there. Uh, okay, the U.S. actually has battleships now. Well, if they've got multiple centerline turrets and a superimposed X... Okay, they're not using the superimposed X on the Missouris, though. They're just using a... Okay, okay. Um, pull this back. Go, go, go to the dongle. So, can I delete that and add on... The X turret? That's legal. All right. Ship is overweight. How many? You don't have four, do you? Okay, no. They have quality zero 13s as well. Uh, okay, it looks like everybody's getting those quality one eights. All my ships are built. All my capital ships are built in the. All my decent ones are built in the U.S. right now. The Cyruses, risky ship order. Oh, I know. I might give it a couple turns and see if that drops down. Bursting charges. Hey, we got our own nine inch guns too. We're, we're, oh, that was a two grand one. That one for the 13 to 15. We're working our way up. All right, there's all the Corvettes now. France went up. We actually have some D, uh, uh, hang on a sec. We've got, okay, no six inches there. Um,. The DeLores are ones I, but they've got some six inch guns. Hang on, we gotta organize this. The walls have six inch guns. Where were these built? France, ooh. Um, fuck it. Send it, send them back to France for rebuild. Judo! Ahoy. Thanks for the doodly. Could you not build something with nine inch main and six inch secondary? Oh, of course I could. I just got access to nine inch guns. So I could do that. A disarmament conference is being held. I will not limit myself. Oh, that's not a good idea. 
The French got mad about- Okay, just don't piss them off for- For- for five more- You know what? We should do the other one while we're- Okay, yeah. Uh, rebuild that- Let's do them both at the same time. Um... Eh. We want to... Rebuild the ship. Do them both at the same time. Eh, hey, more cash! Eh, hey, more cash! Eh, hey, new Matic Recuperator. Okay, that's not that interesting. Build tree says local yards. Uh, did I do those in a local yard? We, 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 were that, was that legal? Do I have access to those 13 inch guns that I'm even putting on there right now? Hmm. Maybe the rebuild doesn't, uh, doesn't know what's going on. New French thingy. Lame. Well, it's actually, six inches of belt armor, 24 knots, 10 inch guns, six inch guns. It's not that lame. I just say it's lame because it's French. I'm, I'm gonna keep my eyes on these, see what happens when they pop off. They're getting big old rebuilds right now. Uprising in an African country is the focus of a great power colonial ambition. Um, I'm gonna try not to, to tension the world right now. Ah! Offering to sell us the rights to ex improved explosive filler. I will take that. Increase shell damage. All right, um, let's take another look at these. Okay, so... We definitely rebuilt them in France because France has access to the better 13-inch guns and I don't, so... I'm gonna guess, I'm gonna say it's a foible. Uh, we can, we can, in, oh. Oh, now, now what we want to do, now what we do is we go open, open design for rebuild, make sure it's built in uh, a local yard, and then do this. Aha, and I can move the six inch guns here. How much is that going to cost? 1,200, okay. For four, well, that's not that bad. No fire control system. Uh, oh, oh, ugh. I think I may have broken the game a little. Okay, now it's back in there. Okay, okay. Oh! <laughs> This is not, this is not working as intended. <laughs> uh, the fire control system is not supposed to fall off when I, when I bring it back to one of my ports. Um, oh, you know what? Maybe my ports can't handle, is it too fat? Oh, it's too thick. It's probably, that's probably what it's doing. Six inch guns perform well versus destroyers. Yeah. No, no, no. Those perform really well against destroyers. Just fine. In fact, you know what I need is new destroyers. So I have access to bigger hulls now. Um, these ones are all 27 knots and either short range or cramped. You know, 28 knots, no cramping. Um, rate them for speed to get myself at least some more, some more juice in there. Um, I'd like more Peters on here. Uh, I'm pretty sure putting another center line on will throw me a a thingy. In fact, rate of fire. That's that's fine on a destroyer. It doesn't really matter. And yeah, don't don't Love worry that. about the six-inch guns V destroyers. They will wreck them. I I use the six-inch guns are probably the most like important class of guns in the game, uh, because they're so useful so for so many different things. Uh, they're my favorite uh, uh, caliber of gun in the game. Uh, can I get those fours back? Not that guns on a destroyer really matter. I guess that's fine. It's three center lines.
The Gondif Gondif Gondified. Long. There we go. Usually use three inches in your game. Three inch guns are two inch and three inch guns are almost entirely useless to use in this game. They're they're entirely entirely shit. If you look into the code, I believe the the two threes and four inch guns all have the same rate of fire. Um, so anything below four inches, in my opinion, isn't even worth touching. Unless you have, like, quality one three-inch guns before you have access to anything better. Um, can six-inch guns get DP? Uh, yes. Uh, so the twos and the threes are pretty useless. I usually, I won't put anything on my ships below four. So four is my, my floor. And usually the only way I'll use a four is if I'm wonking around on weight for some reason, or I have access to high quality fours, or I get dual purpose fours before anything else. But uh, four fives and sixes are all good. Twos and threes are pretty much worthless. Where's the DD on the screen? Like I, like I literally literally just said out of my mouth hole unless I'm wonking around on weight literally said that less than one minute ago I can't afford to put four inch guns on there and guns on a destroyer don't fucking matter not at this stage in the game all right we're gonna just go with that <laughs> Earl, yeah, early DD guns are useless. Until you get to, like, the 1930s, 40s. Um, it's, it's, uh, the guns on Destroyers, they're never gonna hit anything, and they're not gonna do enough damage if they do. Uh, so we're good. According to the Wikipedia, the three-inch guns. Oh, don't, don't, don't listen to the Wikipedia. That's not accurate. Um, I, I, I opened up the code a while back and, uh, was dicking around making mods and a bunch of the, a lot of guns have the exact same rates of fire. I don't remember which ones, uh, are, are identical, but I think, I think like 12, 13, 14s are identical and then like 15, 16s and then like 17, 18s, 19s and 20s are all different. But a lot of the low ones are, have the exact same, um, uh, like stat blocks except for like damage done and stuff like that yeah like it, with this game you can't you can't listen to the um uh you, you can't just read the wiki you can't just read the manual because a lot of the times the ac the information is entirely inaccurate or um out of date all right i'm gonna be i'm gonna build a whole run of these because we need new destroyers I don't know why. Is there? There's stuff I could steal from France. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is fine. This is fine. Look at that. French Indochina's gonna be my bitch. Does this specifically state that difference was from 1.05b? And this is 1.24. New docs, uh, political murder in the Balkans. Demand the guilty party be brought to justice. It's the French, I know it. It's nobody, it's no, it was nobody. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo! Sexy, 2000 tons again. It was no, it was nobody. It was nobody. I almost got these new cruisers done. These are nice cruisers too, especially for China. I can, there's some things I could do. I actually have access to okay guns now. Jesus Christ. Vats is in fire control. Hey, central firing! Woo! That's good. That's really good. Um, I mean, some other countries already had that. But, uh, like, now, open design for rebuild. Put central firing on my ships. Uh, I don't think there's anything else to change on the Cyruses. 18-inch BBs when? Um, 
I gener I mean I I did a lot of really big gun battleships on my last game and honestly I find the big gun battleships pretty boring. I like um to use larger quantities of smaller guns or a lot or, or in 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 the case where I actually max out the amount of guns I put on a ship, just keeping the ships cheaper so I can have more ships. I like to have lots and lots of ships and lots and lots of guns rather than fewer ships and larger guns. I don't really like doing the, the big ones. We did it for lulls last time. I don't know if we're going to be going in that direction this time. Um, oh, change the dock cards uh, to me. I don't think there's anything. I don't think there's anything else to change. Kill whatever needs killing with 16 at the most. Yeah, I mean, even even 14 inch guns is usually enough to, especially when you get increased elevation, even a 14 inch gun does the trick perfectly fine. <laughs> You make me sad. Uh, yeah, we, yeah, yeah. That's fine. We'll just keep, keep, yeah, replace the replace all those doodlies. That's fine. Um, which of these ships don't suck? Uh, these ones are shit. These these ships suck. I'm gonna get rid of these because we're just about to replace them. So scrap those two. They're crap. Um, these are the ones we built for for reasons. Um, I'm gonna scrap them too. They suck. The navy. <laughs> Uh, experimental establishment suggests that the nap and can be extended, uh, expended for gunnery practice. Yes. Pew pew! Advanced our knowledge in AP projectiles. Nice. Uh, now these two were open for rebuild. We'll open up for rebuild. Um. Uh, yeah, we'll do these here. Because I have access to better quality 9 inch guns. I can knock this down to six plus one. And then these came these came with quality one threes. So we'll just leave those on because they're quality one. Uh two 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 two. Okay, uh two two two. Opening up game data, two and three inch guns have a rate of fire of 25, where the four inch guns have a rate of fire of 20. Yes, but there's a caveat. The game has a hard-coded maximum rate of fire. I don't remember. I, I remember dicking around with this when I was trying to I was trying to mod gun data so that guns were more variable in their in their stats. There's a hard-coded highest rate of fire. And I think it takes I think it takes effect. I think it, I think it might be 20. I don't remember off the top of my head, but there it is a thing that exists in the game that really messes with the lower caliber guns. There's a hard-coded highest rate of fire. Uh, do, 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 do. So we're, we replaced that with that. That actually gave us more room. Um, increase that. Increase this. Add on more uh, torpedo broadsides. Boo, 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 boo. Why do auto loaders exist? Auto loaders exist for larger caliber of guns that are significantly lower than that. It's really dumb. Yeah, no, no, I agree. That, that I, I entirely agree. It's weird. It's weird. There's a lot of things about this game that all of the people who play it are are agreed in that it's weird, but the devs will not let us change it and will not change it themselves. So we just have to accept that it's weird. And, and kind of work around it. Uh, uh, so add on the two more torpedo tubes. I don't think I'm a lot. Yeah, we don't run out of space anyway. Um, yeah, I can get, I can up armor the turrets. And that's about it. I can't change the deck extended or the conning tower. Ammo and use it for raiding. Uh, well, if you're if you're raiding, ammo doesn't matter. Um, raiding is basically a amorphous off-screen modifier. Um, so the 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 uh, rounds per gun wouldn't matter on that. And uh, if you increase the rounds per gun, if you change the rounds per gun at all, the time of the project goes up to twelve months. 
Uh, so I think what we'll probably just do is give this bad boy more armor. Thinking for 1v1s or, or 2v2 battles. Um, well, if it was raining, it would never be an engage in a 2v2 battle. I don't think so, at least. I mean, I, usually when it, you, the, the raiding missions that fire are usually just single combats. And, and frankly, at this stage of the game, uh, I don't even think if I maxed out its ammo um, with the low accuracy ratings on the main caliber guns that it would make a difference. Uh, button for additional deck armor. It's one inch. I believe. I, uh, where is it? Okay, I don't think it actually... Sh I think it's one inch. But yeah, we'll just give it a little bit more armor. Um, and that'll be our rebuild for these bad boys. And that'll give us four decent armored cruisers. Which I'm happy with. Uh, managed to acquire knowledge of explosive sweeps from France. Nice. I don't know why France is getting so pissy with me. New ship Enola built in Germany has given us valuable insights into German ship design technology. Nice. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, where's the di divide between turn and gun shield? If I remember correctly, and again, forgive me, I do apologize if I'm, if I'm ever wrong about anything in this game, I apologize. It's really hard to know what things are in this game. Um, two inches, uh, two inches all around. So top and sides have to be two inches all around. And then it's a turret instead of a gun shield. A lot of, a lot of the, uh, the knowledge of this game is the collective knowledge of, man, I just did, I did, did, did just see what my camera was doing there. Um, uh, just gave it a little flicker. Uh, it's the collective knowledge of the community because the only way you can know things is to like is everybody like pooling their knowledge together British government is offering to sell us the right to pre-eaters. That's torpedoes. I, no, no, that's a uh, 1% weight saving Yeah, nice All right destroyers are coming um, The last Cyrus is just about done Hiccup uh, The U.S. is less pissy. So it might not be a bad idea to get a battleship from them. <laughs> 14 inch guns? Are you shitting me? Huh. And I believe we can test the... I think if we do this, uh, put these on here, and then lower the turrets. Do it. Or no, that's turret top. The secondaries. Oh, I thought it would change. I thought it would change. Oh, it just puts it in a little thingy if you have anything on there at all. Maybe I can, maybe I can, maybe I can play with that on a, a light cruiser or something. Maybe I can get more... Uh, oh, it does the same thing. If you put any on there, it shows a different. It shows a, a little difference on there. All right, that's okay. Um, I just wanted to see if it would do the little graphical update at a specific point. But basically, if you have anything on there, it'll just show it. Okay, so put this in the U.S. We're gonna build a uh, a a BB in the U.S. I cannot believe they have access to 14-inch guns already. Seems like big old guns are are going to become a thing early. So we're going to want to shoot for about 20 knots on this. And uh, we're going to put on a X turret. Jesus Christ. That's insane. That is insane. Just, just let's let's just check something. 
Okay. Just wanted to make sure they didn't actually have that. Uh, torpedoes is normal. I like torpedoes. I like that I have better quality six inch guns. That makes me happy. Oh, Jesus. Goddamn Christ. Uh, reduce the secondaries down a fuck ton. Conning tower up, deck extended up, belt extended up, belt up. Okay. Those are, those are big boys. They have torpedo defense. Uh, that I highly doubt. No. That almost never pops till later in the game. How, how big are their docks? Up to 25,000 tons, even. Let's go to 22.5. Some more weight to work with. Probably put more 6-inch guns on there. Oh, they, oh, yeah, they've got a bunch of these bad boys on there. They have, uh, they have quality 1 4-inch guns. So when, when, when you start popping on um, good quality guns, that's when, I, that, that's when I'm like, yeah. Uh, six inch guns. Can I have 20? I can have 20 of six inch. I can have 20 of those. Can I have 22? I can have 22 of those. Can I have 24 of them? I have 24 of them. I think that's a, I think that's a limit. The tech, the tech rate's 30%. The tech rate is 30%. Okay. Okay. Um... Okay. It's a lot of guns. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Turrets are a little low. I'd like to go up to 110 rounds per gun. Secondaries and turrets. I actually could do that. Looks sexy too. Okay. Okay. Didn't ex I honestly didn't expect to be building anything close to this today. Not develop secondary. Okay, so I can't I can't put secondary turrets on this. Okay, so we know that. That's not legal. Everything else is fine though. And I think I'm maxed out on guns at 34. No, oh, is it 36? 36, okay. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, God. Well, firing, three fire control positions. That's about that. <laughs> now, old man, yeah. The, the not developed secondary turrets does not apply to, to singles? Really? Let's try that. Let's see what happens. Now it just says, oh yeah, no, that's right. <laughs> that's weird. Um, okay. Half inch off the belt extended. That's weird. It does not apply to singles, only doubles. That is weird. But anyway, that's a, that's a smexy ship right there. That is a huge jump in, in technology. Pricing it. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. An uprising in China makes it necessary to spend an expeditionary force? Is it an expeditionary force if it's just inside you? We, we must send a strong force to myself. Counterintelligence believes that, wait, you guys stole technology from me? Yeah, no, that's fine, you do you. If, if, if you're so bad off, you're stealing from me, you're fine. Yeah, that was, okay, apparently France is getting a little pissy. 
the two Enolas are good to go. All my light, all my light cruisers are shit, FYI. I'll give it one more turn, and then we'll start building some light cruisers. New government wants to reduce naval spending. Absolutely not. Yeah, France is a bitch. All right, we need new light cruisers. Ours are shit. And they need to be armed with six-inch guns, because that's the best quality gun we could put on these right now. Maybe they stole my six-inch guns. No, it said anti-submarine uh, warfare technology. It was something weird. Clear those turrets off. Hiccup, sorry. Uh, central firing, three positions. Uh, torpedoes going all the directions. Okay. Um, let's call it 6,000 tons. I'm dropping things. Hang on. I'm dropping things. For the Emperor. For the Dowager Empress, yeah. Uh, turrets, we're just going to give it two inches all around. Conning Tower will go up to six. I usually just put minimal armor on a light cruiser because... Fuck it, it's a light cruiser. This Hearts of Iron 3 music. Yes, this is the Hearts of Iron 3 soundtrack. Um, this game doesn't have any music in it, so usually what I do is I either play the Hearts of Iron 3 or the Victoria 2 soundtracks because I really like those. And, all right, let's get some guns on this bad boy. Forward, aft. And I, I, I think what we're just going to do is cram a bunch of doodles onto it. I like that configuration for main caliber guns. On par with Stellaris. Stellaris is, is great, too. I have one gripe about Stellaris' soundtrack, and that is the, um... Uh, I'm not sure if they put it through a compressor or anything like that, or at least balance the levels before putting it into the game, because it's something I noticed when I was recording the game a lot, but the soundtrack does this a lot. Like, it swells really loud, and then it gets really quiet for a while, and then it swells, and then it gets quiet. It's still great, though. Probably just put a couple of these on there uh, in single single turrets, like six, for a little a uh, little extra oomph. And uh, I could either try to give it the two inches around for splinter protection, or. Let's up, uh, s light, light cruisers I have found always need a lot more ammo. So I'm going to go with 175 on that. And then I'm going to add on a port and starboard midship six. Ships that flash fire constantly and ran them into their battleships. I, that's how I play the British is I play, I purposely make ships that go kerplooey. And when I play the British, I do it all... Well, I've only ever played the British live, like, twice. But I, I don't find playing the larger nations usually that useful, like the U.S. And, um, and and Great Britain. So if I'm playing Great Britain, usually I just make ships that explode for lulls. Is this legal? Yeah, everything's fine. I get two inches all around. And I can make it 5,800 tons.
The five inch guns don't don't fit on nicely. I can put them in casements. That protect that would give them some protection. It's not like they're my it's not like they're my main guns or anything. Alright, I think we're gonna go with that. Prodato. There we go. Save that. That was here. Yeah, that was mine. That was in my yards. Two destroyers commissioned. Finishing reconstructions. So I got one more cruiser in there. Reconstructing. Yeah. Cool. Upheaval in Samoa. Screw you, France. France, back down! Ah, the power of China compels you! Alright, uh, let's build up. Uh, I'm not gonna go crazy on these, because I need battleships right now, too. And they're they're ready to go as well. So I'm just gonna lay down... Um, I can afford two of those without too much issues. Okay. Can I improve these at all? I can. A little bit. Oh god, they're fat. Uh, that, that's, that's, I mean, them being fat is, okay. Their secondary armor is complete overkill. So we can rip that down a little. Was Fredato not your colony ship last game? Might have been. Fredato's been picked before. Uh, we're still only looking at four months to do this. Ditch the three inches or upgrade the four. Yeah, I was thinking about that. Up, ju just taking the weight and going up to fours. They're much better than threes. Uh, Can I even go to fives? Yeah, that's not really an issue. Yeah, I can go to fives. Um, six inches are probably if six inch guns are like my favorite, like all round. Five fives are my favorite, like once you get a little ways into the game. The five inch dual purpose guns, I think, are the best. In my opinion, they're they're the best bang for your buck for protecting your ships from airplanes. One second, blow my new. Okay, um, yeah, this is good. Oh my god, 80 rounds per gun? Oh, I can't change that. Alright, that doubles the amount of time it's gonna take, so I'm just gonna leave it. We're just gonna save that. I'm gonna rebuild all of those. It's only gonna take four months. I can afford it. 18,000. Oh, France actually got less mad. Interview which nation is most likely to be an enemy in the future. Well, I know who I think it's gonna be. Yes! Yes! All right, there's the reconstructions. The U.S. government is offering to sell me the right to gyroscopes. Castle, Castle Moat, welcome, welcome. I'll take it. Uh, one more, oh, well, that one's a little delayed. There we go. I'm leaving, as these ships are popping what? off, I'm leaving them on active fleet because we're gonna have to fight France. Which I'm okay with. I'm, I'm itching for a fight with France. They got things I want. Uh, and most of those things are in Southeast Asia. Major arms firm wants to enter a tech sharing uh, uh, agreement with Germany. Yes. Yes, please. One of our cruisers has run aground on the shore of a minor nation while performing an illicit intelligence operation. 
Okay, uh, we're going to war over a little spying. Efforts of ship design. Yes, there it is! <laughs> I've been itching for a fight, you French bastards! All right, I'm gonna. I'm. I'm sending um, most of the fleet south. Uh. Because we are going to be. War! Invading the shit out of everything just French. Some German ass. Oh, I I do fancy just kicking some German ass. Uh, to not the Mediterranean. That's that's a force of habit. So East Asia. There we go. Get Indochina. That's I'm gonna be taking that. I'm just gonna go right down the coast. Start right here. Gonna start right there. Huang Chu Wan. Uh, we are going to take these guys, put them on. Sorry, got an itchy nose. Trade protection. It's plenty. You have the range to invade something. Yeah, things are close together over here. Cruiser action. France declines. Uh, tech sharing agreement with Germany has been of great benefit to our research efforts and light forces in torpedo warfare. Our, with our fleet firmly in control of the waters in South Asia, our troops have invaded the French position of Kuang Chu Wan. Woo! Woo! Yeah! Eat that, you French bastards! Next! Fleet battle! France declines! Fleet battle! France declines! Our forces have taken control of Kuang Chu Wan! Unlimited Chinese power! Send raiders to Europe. Uh, I got some shitty old ships I could do that with. Um, which are the worst ones? These one, these these ones all suck. Um, what the hell's going on? Raider. I mean, what the hell is going on? And let's move that. <laughs> they're all gonna sink. Um, uh, Europe. Good luck. Oh man, Chinese Blitzkrieg, yeah! I have no fleet here, I know, it's great! Oh, we gotta fight, we gotta fight. Uh, it looks just like a light cruiser though, in the middle of the night. Uh, ah, the sun's coming up. Old light cruiser, I mean our new light cruisers are still like a year away, a year or more, year plus. Ship sighted. There she diddles. Those are destroyers. Wiggle your bottom. All right. Speed that up. Okay, I don't think we hit anything. <laughs> we got one one hit from a four-inch gun, and we got hit four times. Oh, they've got an actual. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, I'm outgunned. I am all of the outgunned. Oh my god. All right. All right. All right. There's Frenchies everywhere all of a sudden. All right, we hit this fax a couple times. This looks, looks like a small ship. It's a trap. What the fuck? Eight seven-inch guns and ten two-inch guns. What the fuck is that ship? What in the name of God is that ship? That is that is a that is a lot of derpy derpy uh, armament. Because I'm pretty sure those were those were in. I don't know. These are case. Some of them are casements. Those might be gun shields, and the two-inch guns are useless. All right, all right, all right. Hang on, hang on. We don't want to lose a bunch of new destroyers right off the bat as well, so we'll send them into port as well. Eh, 
she's her, her gunnery has actually been not good enough to drive away the light cruisers. Hit the armored cruiser with a four-inch gun. Uh, she got six inches of belt armor. We're not penetrating that. What did you expect from the French? Yeah, I know, right? 1910, and the French are still building hotel battleships. Hotel everything ships. Uh, oh god. That destroyer was like... Nope, not turded. Alright, um... Yeah, just gotta go to, go to port. Yeah, go to port. Alright, 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 alright. It's fine, it's fine. They outgunned me by a lot. Uh, feelers through neutral nations about negotiated peace without border changes. Nope! Total victory. Uh, subdivision and damage control help from the Germans. Nice. Enemy merchant sunk three. Oh, nice. On the way over. Good on them. Any batteries to build? Uh, we got a lot in southern China. A lot. Okay, let's sort this by location. We've got two in, um, uh, uh, two in, in, in uh, here, two here, two here. And a bunch. Oh, we got a bunch in Korea too. I thought that was all so, uh, South China. A bunch in uh, Korea. But two, two, two. Yeah, actually, there's a number of places that we never built any. Um, Formosa, I'll put two in. Huangshu Wan, I'll put two in. I don't want to spend too much money on it right now, though. Fleet battle. Oh, it's a, it's my invasion. Unknown ship sighted. What do I got? What do I got? Oh, I got lots of things. I got all my cruisers. And I think all my pre-dreadnoughts, too. All right, where are the transports are up here? All right, cool. Tight, 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 tight. All right, uh, take this off AI control. Put these guys at 22 knots so they're not stressing their engines. Uh, you guys, you're going to go up to 18 knots. And you're going to head over this way. Did they actually get some guys over here? Oh, they did. They did. They they got some they got some cruisers over here. There's their pre-dreadnoughts. Right, I'm going to turn back north towards them. We do get we did get our our new um, fire control installed on all of these ships. Hey, first hit, nine inch shell on uh, this bad boy right here, the Conde, Conda, Con thingy. Uh, my crews should be better than theirs uh, as well, because mine have been on active service for a while. I have no view of the. Is this guy injured? One fifteen knots. They did. They did get a fleet over here. It's. 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 There's about a few of them. I'll give them that. They did send a few over here. That's a lot of cruisers, is what it is. It is a lot of damn cruisers. We just want to keep them to the south as much as possible so that our transports have uh, the ability to get where they're going. Oh, Cyrus lands a the first big hit, an 11-inch gun on one of these armored cruisers as well. That should be very effective, uh, you know, if it exploded. Ah, yes. The terrible. Traditional French name. All right. Start getting all my guns uh, firing here. I'm going to grab this last group here and have them basically operate se uh, separately. All right, trade and hits now. Another 11 inch hit over here. The the pot ho starting to do some damage. And we our cruisers are crossing the T on the French pre dreadnoughts. Heading 
Heavy hit on one of my cruisers there. Not a terrible, uh, not a terrible though. Still effective. Land in all sorts of uh, uh, hits here and there. Devastation hit by a seven inch gun. Where did the destroyers get off to? Okay, um. Yeah, I'm gonna grab control over a formation of destroyers. Send them out this way. All the guns firing. All the guns are firing. We're using our cross deck fire. I don't think I've ever used cross deck fire this early in the game before. One of their destroyers just took like a, I think that's at a seven inch hit. Uh, terrible hit with a nine inch gun. Devastation hit with a seven inch gun. Ocean hit with a 12 inch gun. And devastation hit with a seven, okay. Our accuracy is decent. I'm, I'm a little surprised we're actually landing hits. Boy, did the French really send a fleet. I think we stirred up a hornet's nest. This is fine though. We really stirred up a hornet's nest. This is fine. I, I I do not think they're 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 enjoying what happened to their their Chinese colonies. This is fine though. All right, you guys turn north. You guys get in the line. Ooh ooh ooh, we have a problem here. These guys are getting fucked up. Uh, are you on line ahead? Still, you are. Keep going in the same direction. Destroyers are coming in. Uh, we are we are seriously landing good good hits good accuracy I'm I am impressed go to line ahead formation with my destroyers because the this the, their van right now is getting blasted pretty good Taking, taking good hits. Good hits. Here comes the destroyers. Uh, they're not really in the formation that I wanted them in. That's okay. Here they come. Ideally, we just want them to dive straight through the French formation and launch torpedoes at everything. Oh, they are not going in the right direction, though. Uh, 18 can try to launch a torpedo at the Charlemagne here. Maybe. G good, good luck on that one. Now, let's slow this down. Oh. Oh, it actually hit! Oh my god, that was the most oblique torpedo ever. It just kind of like scraped along the side and detonated. <laughs> that was the most oblique hit I've ever seen. I can't believe I can't believe it hit and and I can't believe it detonated. That that one went under. Oh shit! Oh, I rammed it! Oh, can we get that last torpedo off? What about the one we're touching? Ah, not out of arc now, are you, bitch? <laughs> Holy shit, it hit! Oh my god! <laughs> what is going on? I can't believe that hit. Ugh. Oh, I can't. I can't get the uh, the angle on this guy though. In the face! In the face! All right. What about what about you? Can you get a can can um oh a, a lead ship in her class? Try to fire at that terrible. Uh -oh. Success. 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 Uh-oh. Oh, no! 
I'm being cheated out of my... Being cheated out of my victory! By errors! Oh, Randy. Back north with you. I mean, I did put torpedoes into, was it one or two different ships just now? And now we're crossing the T on them again. How's Willy doing? Willy! Some French hacks, exactly. Ah, destroyers getting smashed. Oh yeah, that thing just got. We just, that one just took Cameron! a six-inch hit and just stopped Prepare dead. Prepare to defend yourselves. Oh, she's on fire. I think. I think. I think it's time to launch one of her tor one, one of her torpedoes. Ah, oh, damn it! No, oh, there we go. Sometimes you just need to. Sometimes you just need to jiggle it a little. You just gotta jiggle it. All right, that, oh, they're just they're just blasting the same one over and over and over again. Claymore, oh, this one just took a hit too from a five-inch gun, medium damage. Uh, why don't you guys slow down so you guys they can catch up? Hey, they hit that the the flaming destroyer landed a hit on the terrible imagery landed. Oh, I doubt it. Um, yeah, no, no, they're still on the way over. There's, I think the French set literally everything they have. That's just, they even sent Corvettes over here. They even sent Corvettes. See if I can, before this ship burns down, see if we can put another torpedo into her. Ah, uh, low speed, we gotta get in closer. One of their Corvettes rammed us. Oh my god, I love it. I love the gumption. The Corvette rammed me. Uh, here we are. I just... Wait, what? Oh, no! Oh, fuck me! It was a misidentified destroyer. I was not paying- I was not paying attention to that Corvette because I was like, Corvettes can't carry torpedoes, it doesn't matter. It was a misidentified destroyer. Shameful display. Oh, they're still misidentifying it as a Corvette. Poor, poor, poor ship. Uh, the flooding's not too bad. I'm gonna, I could try to retire her from the battle. They're, even after it launched torpedoes at us, they're like, yeah, that's a, that's a destroyer. I think, th 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 is this the one that got hit? Yeah, that one got torpedoed as well. Hello there. Uh, you guys need to get into line ahead. Your mother's a bitch. I don't know why the AI loves line of breast formation. I found line of breast formation to be almost never useful. So I don't know why the AI is so horny on it. There's a there's a Charlemagne. There's a heavily damaged Charlemagne. Oh, they're not firing at her though. Um Yeah, that one right there. Now the problem is the transports, there's still a lot of guns between the transports and the invasion target, but right now we're still doing really well. Oh, and the Charlemagne's getting blasted. We love you. Shut up, baby, I know it. 
Oh god, who was that? Uh, Dragon Crash, thanks for the Twitch Prime. There we go, couple, well, a couple small hits. Uh, seven inch hits. Five inch hits. All right, she's 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 getting a a smattering of everything right now, though. My gunners are actually doing amazingly well, absolutely astonishingly well. I'm very impressed with their with their accuracy at the moment. Uh, ooh ooh ooh! No no no! This is wrong. This is wrong. Okay, so the wall actually got all of her flooding under control. But I don't want her to sink, so I'm going to detach her. Uh, detach. Set her to only six dots and have her leave the battlefield. And the rest of the formation can return to the battle. Starting to land some hits on some cruisers as well. Oh, the Devastation's coming back! Who, who just torpedoed the Terrible? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter who. They they had a good time of it, though. Um, oh, we got, more, we got more Destroyers in over here, too. Uh, just two of them, but why don't we put them on line ahead? See if we can't get them in here. Do some damage. Be a shame if something happened to you. All right, that looks like a pretty that looks like a pretty good angle to me. Pew! That one that one's sinking. Um, I'm gonna have these guys head back and go for the cruisers. Pew! Oh, it was a dud. It was. Oh no, it missed. I'm sorry. It wasn't a dud. It missed. Oh no! Now they have misidentified signals. Shame! Oh no! They're, they went straight into a formation of cruisers! Flee! Flee for your lives! Devastation hit. Uh, destroy- These just- I, somebody asked if the six-inch guns are effective against the uh, the destroyers. The six-inch guns, like one hit, because these are really small destroyers. One hit is devastating these things. And we've got uh, smaller caliber weapons getting involved in there too. You're moving the bees, not the D's. No, it wasn't that. The um, the direction of the arrow is the direction that the order is. And they were heading straight south and the order was facing north by like northwest. <laughs> and so they were keeping going south while the orders <laughs> were having them go, turning around and going the other direction. So when you see that that happening, them going in the, the opposite direction of what the orders are, that's when they're getting the misidentified signals. All right, I'm gonna turn a little bit to the north here. And have these guys swing around. Those are my cruisers. Got friends coming back down this way, too. Oh, Enola just lost a turret. Enola's getting hit a couple times. I was, all right, let's, let, let's just turn them away. They don't need to engage that. I still want to get the devastation with another torpedo here. Guarantee a sinking. All right, you sons of bitches. This is this is an easy shot. Oh, come on! What did I just say? Wait. Can, um... Someone explain that one to me. <laughs> I launched one torpedo. It missed, and we're claiming two hits. 
And I'm afraid that's something I cannot allow to happen. I know that near misses from large caliber guns can be misidentified as torpedo heads, but I don't know. I'm not sure if I believe that. I don't I don't know if any of those hit honestly. Um I'm going to have these guys head down this way and try to deal with this problem. I'm going to have the cruisers come up this way and deal with that problem. And you guys, uh, I'm going to slow you down to 16 knots, turn north, and meet up with these guys. Basically just got to clear, clear the path for the transports. Uh, oh, but I think they saw the transports. Uh-oh. Now, if all the transports die, it'll be sad, but it won't be the end of the world because there's more Chinese people where that came from. There's that we, we have unlimited population power. Although, I, I mean, I have no idea what the population of China was in 1910, but I'm sure it was a lot, right? I don't know if they're accidentally going this way or if they're actually going for the transports. I feel like it might be an accident. <laughs> also, seriously, kudos to my gunners. Why are transports so slow? Well, I mean, a transport... In this given, in, you know, you know, a small ship, you know, a small transport ship in this time frame, significantly slower than a military ship. You're talking 12 knots, maybe. Maybe even less, depending on how old it is. It would be actually, if they went the other direction, they just, if they went north and then over, that would be ideal. But you cannot control the merchants in any way. Unfortunately. 34 knot transports. Some fast transports. Oh, no, they, they turned. I told them, I was like, you know what would be great? Is that they turned north and then west. And they went south and east. Uh-oh. Okay, okay. You guys deserve to die. That's your own fault. Hundred percent your fault. Transports carrying cargo far over capacity in that era. Oftentimes, yes, and especially once they started doing the convoy system, the convoy, the entire convoy, could only go as fast as the slowest transports. Devastation's taken a uh, couple hits. Okay, they actually turned away. What I, I will say is there's a lot of pre-dreadnoughts here. The French did send a, a heck of a dongle. But I, 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 I'm, get, I'm gonna, I'm, I still feel like, ooh, nice hits. Too little too late is my opinion. The transports are getting away, but they're also not going the correct direction. The devastation's getting blasted pretty good by all sorts of things. A 12-inch hit, 12-inch hit, 6-inch, six 6-inch, six and 11-inch. Oh, that's the Sufrin. It's a different one. But still, good hits, good hits. Devastate. No, 6-inch guns. Oh, love them. So good. I want to sink all of these ships. Oh, come on. That's not fair. I can't get over there. You cheating bastards. Uh, but that's fine. There's another one right here for me to sink, and it looks like it's pretty fucked up. I, I'd, I'd like to sink all these ships if possible. Oh, I forgot about these guys. Um, sorry. Your mother's a bitch. Your mother's a bitch, France. Starting to run a little lower on ammo, but we're still doing really good. 
Seriously, we are doing really well. The accuracy, I am just astonished by. I am untethered and my rage I, I, knows I, no bounds! I'm fully well aware that I left my guys on active fleet for a while, so their training levels were good, but still. Starting to run out of ammo left and right. War! Go to war! All right, they have free reign of the transports now, sadly. Sorry, transports, but you made bad, bad life choices. Is this thing damaged? It looks slow. Light damage. It is. This is not going to be able to go on for too much longer with everybody half out of ammo right now. Oh man! The, da the damaged torpedoed wall just landed what I'm going to classify as a long-range 13-inch hit on the Charlemagne down there. 9,000 yards? Uh, pretty good. Oh, shit, the D D14 is still burning. Um, that ship, also the Charlemagne down there, looked like she was a little on the uh, alone side. So I'm going to see if I can't charge her down with some uh, destroyers. Continuously getting those six inch hits on those destroyers. A couple medium hits there, that's okay. Um I I I I, I am sad that the um the, the I don't think we're gonna succeed in the invasion because uh the of dumb transports, but still they did a great job. Yeah, everybody's running out of ammo. Right, turn away from those sad. destroyers. Charlemagne, I don't know what she's thinking. This devastation, down to 10 knots. Oh, we've already crossed the T on her. Yeah, just keep blasting. Uh, my, okay, their cruisers come out, so turn back south. Devastation's getting blasted. We love you. Shut up, baby. I know it. Real good. Oh, God. Hayate. Hey, buddy. Hello there. Hello there. Do you think the Chung Hua has a solution? She does. I pick them up. Poor bastards. Oh, it's it's hiding behind their flag. Oh, 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 so close. Cruisers have turned around. Destroyers are going after the Charlemagne. Transports are still out and about. Uh, I th we're a little on fire over here. I am going to try to disengage uh, because I believe you could fight fires more effectively. If you are not engaged in combat. All right, number 17. You know what to do. Oh my God. A destroyer just ate two seven inch guns. That's impressive. That's impressive for a casement firing seven inch gun. This guy right here. That one, that one ran deep. Come here, you, oh God. Turn better. Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't think that's it. Ram it. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Well, it kind of went right through there. Uh, that, that, hmm. Okay, they're telling me it's a hit. That looks like a hit. Okay, she just ate two torpedoes. Chasing down the devastation over here. 
uh, come around here and try to cover these guys. Charlemagne. Uh, she's still making a lot of speed. So we're going to try. The wall's got to go back the other way. Devastation's taking hits again. I gotta say, this is a very much more interesting battle than the last ones we fought. Uh, you guys, back to A. Oh, you're already on A. What? That's not what that says. Um, ooh, that thing's on fire. Devastation. I don't think it's going to come out of this uh, alive. This Charlemagne's getting hit pretty good as well. Honestly, our accuracy is really good, and the French accuracy is ass balls, which is just delightful. They, did, they don't seem to have actually gone after the transports either. Uh, fires out. Devastation and the Charlemagne are both getting it bad. Devastation is on fire. The Willy Ho has got two disabled. It's perfectly fine, but both primary turrets are jammed. FRS at nine. Oh, what happened? Did it blow up? Did it blow up? <laughs> I knew. Uh, I knew it was something. Something was happening today. Did S at nine explode? Ah, oh, I wish I could see it live. <laughs> They want to ship us at nine. I'm sure we can. <laughs> Someone tell me what happened. I'll watch it later. I want to know though. Anytime I see a destroyer pop up, man, yeah, seriously, the, the five and the six inch guns are being really effective against the light ships. Did it blow up in the air? Did it blow up on landing? Did it blow up on launch? Where'd it blow up? Belly flopped into the concrete. Ah, oh, cool. I want to see that. I want to see it. <laughs> Heavy, heavily damaged and on fire. Watch that later. It over... Oh, oh! Oh, did it actually do the flip and then go all the way over and just... Poof. <laughs> Oh, that's cool. I want to. I want to see that. I really want to see that. I want to watch that later. Uh, how's this one doing? Heavily damaged. She's still. That thing ate multiple torpedoes, and she's still going. She's. She, it says she's heavily damaged, but she's still moving. I feel like we've at, we we're doing massive damage to the French fleet here. I really feel like even though we're not like not a lot, all these ships are gonna sink. I feel like a lot of these ships are at least gonna be in uh, in, in uh, done fucked for a while in repairs. Oh no, the sun, my nemesis! <laughs> Shit balls. That means what I basically need to do is tell everybody to re retire from the battle and call it a day as is. And and don't continue to engage anymore. My cruiser, as the sun came down, my cruiser formation found theirs. I'm gonna turn away from it though. I don't wanna get engaged in a, okay, they, they, they They've changed course to, to mirror me. Would have pushed my luck. Uh, we're running low on torpedoes and ammunition. I've sp expended most of the torpedoes from my destroyers.
All right, they, they're, on, they're on the transports now. But that's okay. We knew that was going to happen. We could, the, the transports were just in a shit location. We weren't going to save them. Uh, I haven't used any of the torpedoes on my light cruisers yet. Maybe if we're lucky. All right, whatever that was, just ate a torpedo from a light cruiser. Fire the second torpedo on the port side. The 100 yards. And pivot. Uh-oh, the wall. What what for me? I think she Oh no, she's not where I want her to be. I think she re, uh, reattached to, yeah, attached. She reattached to one of the formations and started going along with them. I hate, I, I, if I manually detach someone, I never want them to do that. Uh oh. Something, something rammed something. <laughs> Come back at this. Identify what? I don't think I can. I, oh, you're out. You're out. I'm pretty sure I can't fire torpedoes at, at things that are unidentified, which no, I cannot. Lucky fucks. Because that's something bigger. It's a CA. Theoretically. Better fucking hit. Hey, we got it. Nice. I don't want to. I didn't. I was hoping we didn't ram a ship and lose a new destroyer for nothing. All right, all our torpedoes are expended. Back to AI control. Uh, as another. As okay, all three torpedoes hit. Oh shit! Uh, you're out of torpedoes. Uh, blah! Oh no! Flee! Flee for my life! Oh my god. Good battle. Good battle. All right, now I'm going to tell everybody to start heading off this way. The transports are not going to survive. We're not going to get I don't think we're going to get a successful invasion anyway. But that's okay. Cuz we did ridiculous damage to the French fleet. It's actually a lot of time left on the battle too. But again, out of torpedoes, out of ammunition, uh, several of our ships are damaged, out of formation, then sun's down. We're just gonna head back to port now. This is an offensive invasion, so failing to actually get the invasion off just means we try again later. Woo! I don't know how many ships. I'm gonna say we sank four. That's my guess. Is four in one cruiser, plus smaller ships. That's my guess. Is four pre dreadnoughts, one armored cruiser, and uh, smattering of of little baby guys. The ship can slow down because it's sinking a little. It, it's it's not running away. It's a strategic withdrawal. Strategic withdrawal. There's a fair bit of strategery involved. How many ships I lose? I don't know, like three destroyers, maybe. No. Not much. Four destroyers. And unfortunately, all the transports. What? I only sank two of those? Are you shitting me?
I only sank two of those. That means the ship that I put like three torpedoes into and left survived. Are you shitting me? But oh, I heavily damaged, medium damaged, nine lightly damaged. Jesus Christ. That's still a stunning victory. Yeah, 6,000 victory points up to, uh, to, uh, oh, you know, I'm shit, that's fine. <laughs> After a victorious battle, our troops, uh, they swam ashore. Parliament, Parliament authorized additional war loans. Uh, tech shared agreement with Germany continues. AP projectiles. Uh, some sinking is going on. They've got a light, they got a heavy cruiser in Southeast Asia. Um, so I'm going to put one of my heavy cruisers on Raider now in Southeast Asia to try to block him. Sheer willpower, yeah. All of the corpses washed ashore and the Frenchies just went, if they've got that many people to throw away. How much longer for these? Uh, yeah, we got a year still. That's fine though. Cruiser action. Ugh. My cruiser actions for me right now, if I don't have a heavy cruiser are, are awful because our light cruisers are shit. So I'm just going to turn around and head back. <laughs> it's a French surrender to corpses, yeah. You want to continue searching? No. Yeah, no. My, my, like, my current light cruisers are terrible, so I don't want to engage with them if I don't have to. Three to five. Yeah, they got shot. Okay, they've actually showed up to combat now. Hey, Cody! Thanks for the redo. I joined Hi, Ben. They actually showed up this time, but we've already taken one possession and we're fighting for the second one, so it's fine. New docs complete. Spy from Great Britain's been discovered. I do not want them involved, so handle it quietly. Forces it. Oh no! Well, enemy fleets dominate the seas around Kuang Chu Wan. How, how much shit did they possibly bring over here? Ooh, 14 enemy merchants sunk. Oh, dominates a strong word, you twats. That's a real strong word. Uh, I'll put these guys on Raider and move them. Oh, wait, they already were on Raider. Uh, Northeast Asia. You're really gonna make me do this, aren't you? Come on, France. Convoy defense. France declines. So tech share agreement with Germany's working out. Explo uh, research efforts at explosive shells. Destroyers up to 700 tons. Nice. More merchants sunk. Okay. Now, 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 now who's dominating, bitch? Can do this again, though. Convoy defense again. Uh, what do we got? Nothing but a smattering of destroyers. That's sad. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say my destroyers are more worthwhile as, um, suicide ships against enemy pre-dreadnoughts and cruisers than defending a convoy. So, sorry. Frankly, destroyers of this era have difficulty sinking transports themselves because there's just not enough firepower in there and torpedoes often are in limited quantities and duds. So I'm just gonna leave them to their devices. Bye! I don't have anything, uh, destroyer slap fights are boring anyway. Just head up this way. Only one hit so far. 
So with your focus on engines and machines, will your destroyers and cru uh, cruisers be fast as fuck? In theory, yes. I mean, most of my destroyers are right now are still uh, legacy designs. I only built a dozen myself, and we just lost three or four of them. Um, but I did just get access to larger destroyers, so we need to design an updated destroyer anyway. I like how we're just fleeing to port, and, and we just hear the soft sounds of kerplosions all over the place. All right, everybody. All, all, all the destroyers basically ended up with engine problems. So they're all going different speeds now. Go to port. Well, I, I honestly think not many transports sunk. I'm gonna say two. One, zero, ha! <laughs> no, 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 I'm sorry, one. I was reading, the, I was reading that wrong. One, just one. They only got one. That should be a victory for me. Smashing victory! Army wants more resources to prepare for an offensive. Nah, Navy's got this. Ooh, 1% weight saving on hulls. Another eight merchants sunk. Not bad, really. Uh, it does look like France is transferring a fuck ton more tonnage over here. Let's take a look at the almanac real quick. Um, they've got 19 pre-dreadnoughts to my 16. Tonnage is similar. Heavy cruisers is where, yeah, they've got 300,000 tons of heavy cruisers. That's where they're, yeah. There's that's that's about a few in there. Con Ooh, convoy attack. These are spicy. As long as I get at least a, a ship with... Oh! Oh, a convoy attack in the night with pre-dreadnoughts. Oh, no. This is a bad idea. All right, sun's coming up, though. We got a lot of stuff here. We got cruisers, pre-dreadnoughts, light cruisers. Got all sorts of guns. I think I found them! <laughs> Cruisers are good at this. There is all sorts of ships here. Holy crap. Um, Lone Destroyer. I'm going to need you to break up that formation to make it easier to attack. Uh, you guys go to Squad Max. Pre-Dreadnoughts, uh, start knocking on the back door. All right, good luck, little brave little guy. All right, Charlemagne, prepare to eat it. Okay, this is something we're gonna have to remember. The French ships need to be like triple tapped to sink. Oh, I, I, I missed the Charlemagne, but I might hit the Galilee. All right, they both missed. All right, you got one more opportunity to get the Charlemagne here. Don't fuck it up, you little bastard. Ah, oh, you fucked it up, you little bastard. All right, well, um, what I will say is that the convoy is undefended now. I apologize for nothing. Poor little man. He didn't he didn't even get a single hit. I honestly think one of those may have been a dud. Because it really looked like one of those went right into an enemy. Oh, this thing just took an eight, a 13 inch shell. Oh, that, that, that sounded, that looked like it hurt. Murder, murder, murder. Murder, that ship, murder, that, murder. That, that, that cruiser just took a, that's the biggest caliber gun I have.
All right, transport's getting hit. Looks like they're laying a lot of smoke, too. Oh, they stopped. All right, now we're gonna pivot off here. Oh my God! I don't know, if I, I went by. I, I, I went by really quickly. I swear to God, I just saw a destroyer take a 13 inch shell. Yes, Leah! Leah was asking a question. All right. Transports! All right, all right, here come the cruisers again. Sneaking it, sneaking it along on the other side now. Uh, let's have them focus fire on the transports as they go by. Or maybe the closer ones. It's gonna be probably these guys right here like this. Transport's right in front of them, yeah. Solid damage to the enemy fleet already. Couple hits there, no biggie. Again, the transports are the goal here. And I'm seeing a lot of transports getting butt fucked. Uh, six transports sunk. Um, looks like they're doing a flotilla attack, but my secondary and tertiary guns are, ugh, drove them right back. That looked effective. All right, this ship got hit a couple times. F uh, five medium hits, four lights. This one's okay still. Um, let's go to 20 knots and turn around. See if we can't finish off the stragglers. I'm seeing numerous 13 inch hits. Uh, how many have we landed? Two here and uh, one there. You know, it's, oh no, that's not a 13 inch. Uh, that's not a story. Uh, these, these ships that were armed with 13 inch guns bought those from France. Charlemagne is falling out of formation. She's slowed down. Back north. Sufrin just took a 13 inch hit. All right, um, pivot! We're gonna, sit, we're gonna try to coup de gras the Charlemagne here. Uh, this ship looks like it's got a busted rudder or just not responding. We're gonna we're gonna cross the butthole on the Charlemagne. Oh 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 oh! Charlemagne just hit this one pretty good. Oh, and she's falling. Did he hit a rudder? Dr jam the rudder to port. Charlemagne, you bitch. I don't know if I can actually get a torpedo into her. I can try though. She just got hit by two Your mother's a bitch. shells. They, I feel like bull ships are maneuvering for a torpedo angle right now. Turn away. Uh, let's grab at least just just yeah, just one destroyer is fine. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh come on! Oh just missed! Just missed. Alright, Nola's going after the rest of the transports. I'm going to slow down to 15 knots. Yeah, Nola's going after those guys. Uh, 
wall is on fire and it's getting bad. Or no, no, no. Ooh, actually, yeah. The fire, the fire is 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 getting, or, or the structure is is pretty fucked up here. All right, pivot off of this. I'd really like to not have a ship burn down. That would annoy me. The rest of the transports are going down. It's getting yeah. I got I gotta try to take her out of the combat. I don't know if slowing down helps with fires. It helps with flooding, but I don't know if it helps with fires. I've heard conflicting reports on that. I know being out of combat helps with fighting fires. Hey Sarge, how you doing? But I don't know if, oh! Destroyer got hit with a 12 inch shell. Yeah, heavily damaged. But well, apparently one of my pre-dreadnoughts uh, detached from the formation. That's not looking good. It's still on a two. It's one of my better ships. I'd really like it not to... to burn down. Is this ship still controllable? It is. She's only got, oh, she's only got 13 knots though. I need to try to get these guys off my ass. That fire is the only thing that's problematic right now. Hey. See if we get a, a torpedo off here. Let's slow this down again. Whoop! Up! Oh shit! <laughs> one hit, one kill! One pre dreadnought enter, one destroyer also enter, one destroyer leaves, but only temporarily because the other pre dreadnought has friends. How's the new apartment? New house! New house is great! It's amazing. I got pictures on Twitter if anybody wants to see. Moved a week ago. Good luck. Oh, that looked like that looked like a hit. I think that may have been a dud. Well, I mean, oh, that's not gonna hit. Oh, he's going after the destroyer. Uh, well, I did just sink a pre-dreadnought with a single torpedo, which is nice. I can't complain about that. I'll try to screen my guys from their destroyers as much as possible. Uh, check the fire. Is the fire out? Fire is out, but the structure is heavily damaged. So let's uh, head, ba uh, head back up to speed. Nola just hit. Charlemagne hit. No, we'll hit again. So yeah, let's uh, pull away. Considering this was a attack on an enemy convoy, I'm gonna say this was a smashing victory. One one guaranteed one guaranteed uh, pre dreadnought sunk. The entire fleet of transport sunk, and a number of destroyers as well. But he's uh, starting to run lower on ammo now. Wall hit again. Always, oh, they're going for the lead ship of the formation. The, look, the, the ship is taking it like a fucking champ. I gotta say that. Yes, turn away, you French bitches. I 
grab this last one to rejoin the formation. Gonna try to drive them towards us to get them closer. Yes! I've got you now! Yes, drive them closer. Man, this thing is this thing is landing some hits. Let's hope Charlemagne doesn't No no don't don't pull alongside. I don't want to get torpedoed by her. I'm just gonna swing around behind. Oh, there she goes, rejoined to the formation. Uh, I got destroyers out here still I can control. So we can, uh, swing around. Chase her down. Uh, just landed a couple hits on this cruiser. Lots of hits on that cruiser. Lots of hits on uh, both of these cruisers. Come on. Oh, that thing just took one hit. Oh, the other ones got scared. Charlemagne, you bitch! Alright, that's a perfect torpedo solution right there. That cannot miss. That is impossible to miss. Ah, I missed! Missed. The cruisers are getting Charlemagne right now. Okay, okay, the cruisers have torpedoes too. Uh, Devastation's coming back as well. All right, that was one hit. And we, I've put three torpedoes into this thing before with nothing. You guys go after the Devastation. Ning Hai. Put another one into her. Again, confusion. I saw the torpedo go under. Devastation's uh, separated out now, at least, though. Enola's on fire. Charlemagne's still getting pinged. She's only registering medium damage, and she's still going full speed. Oh, fires are out. Uh, I believe I only have the port torpedoes available. I do, so I gotta switch sides. No, no, switch sides! Turn harder! <laughs> She's slowed down, but she's still only registering light damage. And she's still firing. Oh, now she's on fire. All right, all right, all right. Uh, out of arc still. <laughs> really blasted the superstructure. Still fire it back. Okay, that looks like a good angle. Uh, I think we had another dud. Heavy damage and on fire. Just keep shooting! Got the devastation stuck here, it looks like. I mean, they're landing lots. And we got 49 8-inch hits, 58 um, 6-inch hits here, 19 9-inch uh, hits, and 49 6-inch hits, and only 
Three, three inch hits. What shit guns? Tertiary gun sock balls. She looks dead in the water almost. Not dead in the water enough though. All right, now, now dead in the water. Now dead in the water. Can I get another one off? Oh, that's a bad angle. That's a bad angle. All right. C come on back. Come on back. One more. Oh, did we? Oh, we lost the devastation. That's my fault. I was, I was paying attention to the Charlemagne. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Pew! Yes! Pew, pew, motherfucker! God damn you, Charlemagne! God damn you to hell! Oh, okay, that makes me feel a little bit better. Okay, just put... I don't even know how many torpedoes that was into Charlemagne there. Son of a bitch! Fuck you! God damn it, dude! Oh, oh hey! <laughs> Hi, Mordred and friends! So, so, so it came into me rampaging about Charlemagne. All right, and the French destroyers are 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 attempt. Are they making? They're trying to make passes at me, but it's not going that well. The devastation is on fire as well. Medium damage, only going. 10 we love you. On sure, fire. baby, I know it. And ballistic bishop, welcome, welcome. So we we too technically have a four knot speed advantage right now, so we might be able to catch her. And who knows? She might burn down. That destroyer just ate a dick. It just took like three or four shells and went dead in the water. Oh, there's another Charlemagne! Ooh, heavily damaged! Ah! Low hanging fruit! Alright, do we reload the torpedo tubes? Uh, torpedo tubes loaded? Torpedo tubes loaded! Alright, Charlemagne number two! Dun 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 dun! Dun 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 dun! Weak as gazelle! Well, her, she had no visible damage. She is only going 10 knots though. I feel like if we keep chasing that devastation down, we might be able to force her to just burn down. Alright, they're starting to land uh, hits. Ooh, Charlemagne is firing back. We're, oh, I think we might be running out of ammo. Yeah, forward turret out of ammo. Um, the rest of them are okay though. But the uh, the four, so we're not gonna we're not firing on the forward arcs anymore. So we got we, we got to pull alongside and help help from the <laughs> hope for the best. Watch that YouTuber ages. Glad I finally catch you live. Welcome, welcome. Good to have you. All right, so it looks like the destroyers have pretty much abandoned the devastation, who is now only making five knots and still burning. Uh, all right, right here. Here's the other Charlemagne. Just keep pumping it. We've got we've got plenty of shells left uh, in the other turrets as long as we can keep the angles. Just keep blasting away. Not eight, nine, and uh, six. Oh, 13 inch hit on the devastation. Heavily damaged. Come on. Oh yeah, the devastation's getting, oh, oh shit. Uh, yeah, it went dead in the water. Okay, um, fire a torpedo. Fire a torpedo. I didn't realize it went completely dead in the water. Uh, and one more. Port side torpedo fire. Okay, yeah, that thing's not going home. All right, pivot south. And yeah, keep firing on the Charlemagne. All right, cross the T. Let's fire a torpedo just to get her to change course. 
Hoping to pivot to the left. Nope. Or to the right. That's okay, though. Lots of hits. She had, no, she's not on fire. She's just... Just trying to get away as fast as she can. It's making smoke. 20% ammo remaining on one of these cruisers. She looks... I think we just slowed her down. Yeah, five knots. All right, opportunity. Fire torpedo. Fire torpedo. Oh, uh, out of arc, really? Okay. Getting closer. Don't get hit by my own torpedo. All right, try it now. All right, Char okay, Charlemagne number two. I took out two Carling brothers. That makes me feel good. Okay, that one was a dud. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. We learned from our last battle that the French probably have good damage control and that we are going to need to fire, or do more damage that is, than we think is necessary. Really? A oh, son of a bitch! Just missed a fucking almost stationary target. Come on. There we go. She's still making five knots. And we're running out of ammo. Uh let let's do a let, let's do some gunnery practice on her. With my uh, with my pre-dreadnoughts here, let everybody have a go as we pass by. If anybody wants to fire a torpedo as well, I mean, have at it. Some of these are gonna be low probabilities to hit. Both those hit. All right, that ship is definitely sinking now. All right, all right. Uh, so I think we sank with four pre-dreadnoughts and the entire convoy. Four pre- We sank all the heavy ships they had here. All four pre-dreadnoughts we sank in every single transport, plus two destroyers, for a loss of four destroyers. That was a bigger victory than, than the battle in the invasion battle we had. That was a larger victory than the invasion battle. Holy shit. Battle of the South China Sea. Oh, and our six inch coastal batteries are uh, done too. Uh, I'm gonna be right back guys. I gotta take a real quick bio break. I'll return in a mo. Okay. Proper ass whooping indeed, Gabe. Proper ass whooping indeed. Uh, feelers through neutral nations but negotiate peace without border changes. Uh, no, I just whipped you like the red-headed stepchild of a rented mule. Uh, tech sharing agreement with Germany has been of great benefit. Our research efforts in AP projectiles increased. Capped AP projectiles. AP penetration improvements. And we figured out what blimps are. Well, we may... We know in theory what a blimp is. Uh, invasion of Tonkin delayed due to unfavorable weather. 12 more merchants sunk. Beautiful. Uh, we can keep building our docks as well. 
Jesus, man. Holy hell, yeah. They, they were, oof, yeah, we did a lot of damn damage to the French fleet. Holy shit. That's impressive. I want more than one holding. I'd like at least two, so I want this to keep going. Latest army offensive was halted by the enemy after 200 yards of advance, uh, despite several waves of attacks. Enemy gained 100 victory points. I really feel like, uh, given it's 1912, 200 yards of advance seems like a stunning victory. Uh, German fleet tactics. Nice. More, more merchants sunk. It's going well. Uh, why don't we build a couple more coastal fortifications? Oh, shit. I didn't realize how close these were, actually. Some of our, these battleships are only 14 months away now. Nice. Uh, boop, 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 coastal fortifications. So we got Rosa. On Quichuan, China, Shanghai, Southern China, Korea. Where are we missing some batteries? I think Hokkaido's the only one that doesn't have any right now. Build two there. Army more money to give them a higher chance. There is a random event that'll fire that'll basically be like, give them money or don't give them money. Um, I always say no. I think the I, I think the most money you can ever or the most victory points you can ever get out of an army offensive is a thousand. And given the fact that I'm getting that these big vic naval victories are getting me like six seven thousand points, and this is early game, a thousand and it doesn't scale up as the game goes on. It's just the land stuff is so minute compared to what ha how many victory points you get for naval victories and defeats. It's just not worth it. It's just not worth it. The land stuff just sucks. Some of my ships were not mobilized. Whoops! Cruiser action. The cruiser actions could probably be, again, a little scary. My cruisers are shit. And, um... They have a lot more cruisers, so whenever a cruiser action fires, I'm just going to retreat. Oh, you tricky fucks. Oh, they just had some destroyers out there. Maybe maybe the coastal batteries will be able to protect me. Although it doesn't look like they're doing much. Four hits. Coastal battery accuracy is really low in this game. Uh, can you... Can you get inside here, please? Yes, there you go. <laughs> Had to bump my face into the shoreline to be able to, um... Be able to get into the port. Hey, 69 victory points. Man, tech sharing agreement with Germany, like, every month is getting me benefits. Research efforts in fire control technology. Subdivision and damage control technology. Advancements in fleet tactics as well. Woo! Uh, improved signaling. Great. Ah, oh, another delayed invasion. Seven more merchants sunk. Still going well. At most 15... Oh, does it go up to 1,500? Yeah. Still not a lot. Anti-German rebellion broke out in Southwest Africa. Convoy defense. What do we got? Again, just a bunch of destroyers. So, again, what I'm going to do... Uh, because destroyers are so horrible at this stage of the game. I'm just gonna tell the destroyers to le leave the convoy to their own devices and hope the nighttime saves them. It's not worth losing destroyers right now for a convoy defense when I need them for screening my pre-dreadnoughts and making suicide runs. Sorry, cracking my back there. Ah, Some weather rolled in, but I could hear explosions. They definitely fouled them. Let's see what happens. Uh, <laughs> one of the merchants got rammed. 
probably worse for the destroyer than it is for the mer for the merchant. Okay, all right. There's some ramming. I, I, seriously, if you're in a merchant ship and you ram a destroyer, I feel like the destroyer's probably gonna go down. They sank. They sank just two, just two. Surprisingly, those ramming attacks didn't do much. I mean, a destroyer right now is like 600 tons, and a merchant ship is several thousand. Still one. Subdivision and damage control again. Torpedo technology. Efforts for submarines. Hey, and new torpedoes. 11 merchants sunk. We're still doing really well. Hey, invasion battle. Let's see, let's see. Okay, so the transports are much closer to the target this time, but I'm further away. So, you guys... I gotta... Okay, yeah, we gotta go this way. Do I have my... Cruisers? Got light... Here they are, here they are. I got three cruisers here. You guys need to... Screen the, the transports. So how many... Uh, we've sunk... We sank four and two... So we, I know we've sunk at least six French capital ships. Uh, I think there may have been some more. But I know, because I, I, I mean, we fought several battles murder, right murder, now. Murder. I think we've done, we've done at least murder, six, murder, I know murder. that. Oh, they see the transports. They're going straight for them. All right, uh, destroyers. Remember how I said something about a suicide attack? Line ahead, please. I'm gonna need, I need you guys to break up that formation of pre-dreadnoughts heading straight for us. They're not turning away. France. France? Oh, ho, 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 ho. Charlemagne! I see you! Oh no, I'm getting... Uh, wait, 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 215, there we go. Here we go, here we go. Char uh, Sufrin, no, Charlemagne. You got it, do you have an angle on anybody? You do. On Charlemagne! All right, let's slow this down. ba -doo! Oh, only one hit. All right. Well, I was hoping Charlemagne would get Eiffel Towered, but no such luck. All right. Devastation. And T-15. Fire at... <laughs> Sorry, that snuck up on me. The Sufrin. You guys suck. All right, back to AI Get control. Back. <sighs> that, that, I feel like that should have been much more, that was like the perfect torpedo strike. I didn't get anything out of it. Well, I got one hit and I disrupted the formation, so. Order a flotilla attack with these destroyers here. Sufrin's getting it. Anola just hit with three shells, slowed her down. All right, Ning, Ning Hai might be able to get a torpedo off. Anola? I did. I do have uh, superior German torpedoes now. That missed. Uh, Kai Chi. See if you can get one off. Ning, try again. Nice. 
Ah, she just keeps turning. Good, good damage, but no such luck. Is Char Charlemagne is the one we damaged again? All these ones are damaged now. That one's on fire. All right, let's turn the line in towards them. I got an itch there. Destroyers are trying, but not really doing much. Well, this is not exactly how I wanted this to go. <laughs> Don't nobody ram anybody. <laughs> These guys can all torpedo each other. That's not ideal. Sufrin hit with a torpedo. Devastation. Go for the devastation. Sorry, my eyes itch all of a sudden. I think I got like a blast of cat dander in my eyes. Uh, devastation. Fire the devastation. Not not a not a great not a great shot. Again, not a great shot. Oh god, oh god. Pivot! Cyrus! Cyrus, you know what to do! Cyrus! Cyrus! He missed. Alright, Cyrus! No, uh, pot! Pot ho! Uh, uh, devastation. Fire at the butt! Right in the butt! Willy! Willy in the butt! Come on! You fucks! You I mean, they're all- they're all getting heavily damaged by the gunfire. But none, none of the torpedoes have hit. But they're all- they're all damaged from the gunfire. So there is that. Come on, come on, number nine. Come on. Hang on, I'm gonna take control of these cruisers here. Let the destroyers do their thing. Yeah, I mean, these guys, let's see. This one is heavily damaged on fire, heavily damaged, uh, medium damaged. That is like less than a hundred yards. I swear to God, if you miss. Can't believe you still use coal. Well, I'm on 30% tech rate. At coal is coal is where it's at. Oh, Charlemagne hit. Wei Ching? Chin? King? Chin. Probably shipping line of fire. Can't get him. Alright. So those two are dead in the water. Let's try to cut off the devastation. Do I have- I don't have a snoot torpedo on this guy. Come on. Oh, it's low speed. Ugh. I hit anybody with that. Whoa! I didn't even know I had- oh, right! I was like, I didn't even know I had all these guys. Uh, they were all in a line, and then when I started giving, uh, orders to the head of the formation, they just kind of spread out. I forgot that they have a tendency to do that. The AI is really bad at keeping ships in a straight line. It can't do- it can't do it. Hang on a sec. Um, I'm getting a call from the auction house I bought some furniture from. Hang on a sec. It was just the auction house where I sometimes buy stuff from. Um, they were like, we're, you're, we're, we, we're, your address isn't, isn't right in our system anymore. I was like, oh yeah, I moved and I didn't change my address with like some people who sent me flyers and stuff like that. But that's fine. Good auction house. They have good stuff there. It's 
where I got a lot of my furniture. Well, some of my furniture. All right, so um, this thing is not looking good. It's still, it's still not having a great day. Um, the light cruisers are having trouble. Oh, she's on fire now. The cruisers fired torpedoes and missed. Of course they did. All right, and all the ones at the back of the formation. Oh, fuck you guys. Idiots. Idiots! You're all idiots. The transports are... Oh, they're going the wrong way! <laughs> they got, like, most of the way there and turned around. Oh, you idiots. Well, that's at least a couple more bee bees down, so that's good. Uh, we apparently hit a mine. Call it a mine. Light damage my ass. Reload the torpedo tubes and come back around. This devastation is is burning and only going five knots. Uh, let's head the back around with the cruisers. And north with... Oh, you guys are not in line formation. Uh, line ahead formation, please. Turn together off. Slow down to 16 knots. Turn north. And same thing here. Line ahead formation. 16 knots. Pivot! There we are. I haven't really seen the oceans too much. Single 12 inch guns, 12 6 inch guns, and 8 4 inch guns. Actually pretty weak. This thing, we just can't get that one. We've, 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 we've whiffed on it a lot. Every single time I see one of the Charlemagne classes, I just want to go, I suddenly remembered my Charlemagne. And my hobbies be the rocks and the trees. Birds of the sky. All right, all right. Does this destroyer have any torpedoes left? One. Oh, I can't grab control of it, though. Shit. I'm going to get you. All right, they have access to their own port here, so they're probably gonna be able to get away if I damage any of these guys. We'll just uh, shoot at the devastation, make sure she doesn't go home. Oh, she pivoted back on me while I wasn't paying attention, you dirty whore. Oh, oh, the transports made it. it just, I just got the notification that four transports made it. So we got a landing off and we have sunk several enemy ships again. Oh, this is, this is a thousand times more interested than fighting the, the Japanese. And I actually get a good fight going. Every once in a while, they're getting six inch hits. Uh, yes to all there. You know what? Um, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. We got we got some battleships coming down this way. Let's have them take care of it. The light cruisers just can't handle it. He's too he's too dodgy. He's too dip dive duck dodge and dodgy. Uh, oh, those are pre dreadnoughts too. God, I have I forgot that I transferred more pre dreadnoughts down here. I honestly forgot that I did that to counteract some of their um, uh, the weight that they brought over. All right, now she's on fire. Uh, these guys will go after the ocean. Let's see if we can get her. Uh, line of breath. I don't know why the AI does that. It always fucking does that. It's, I swear to God, that's got to be a bug. Like, it, it constantly sets everything to... Um, uh, line, line of breast formation when you want them on line ahead. I swear that's got to be a bug. I don't know why it would ever want to do that. Line ahead for you want you're gonna want line ahead formation like 98 percent of the time. Ocean's got heavy damage. Try to uh, hit her from this side as well. Sufrin, how are you doing? Heavy damage and on fire. Oh yeah, I, I can. 
two poops. That's amazing. So many poops from so many dogs. Hey, Theo. What's up, little monster? Hi. I will go to the field. Maybe people want to say hello to the monster. Oh, look how big she's getting. Look at this giant dog. Oh, oh, big puppy dog. Such a good girl. Ah, get, get wiggly. <laughs> She's too busy scratching. She's too busy scratching. All right, cut the cut the ocean off here. Get her from the other side as well. Maybe. You guys firing at her? You are. Turned into a bit of a mess here. Head up this way. Trying to keep track of like eight different formations of ships going all over the place. So is it Sufrid still burning? Still burning. All right, point blank range. That ship looks small, doesn't it? Only 13,000 tons. All right, everybody shoot it as we go by. Yeah, there we go. Heavy damage. Eh, not as devastating as I was hoping. Well, we, we definitely won this battle. I hope that we could get the invasion, we could finish the invasion, though. Because the last one was immediately defeated, which was unfortunate. Hello there. Hello there. Hey, Epic, how you doing? Hi, Penelope. How is my big girl? Did you want to say hi, too? Did Penelope want to say hi, too? Okay. Okay. You know what? You know the routine. Oh, good neck scritch. Oh, just the best neck scritchums. Yeah. Oh, that was she was in she was in great need of a neck scritch. And now now Theo's getting jealous. She's right here. Hi, I smiles. He smiles. He's smiling at. How about it? How about a ear scritch? Oh, oh, oh! Look at that! Look at that face. And you, you stay here, I'll go get you a treat. I'll be right back. There's a little cookie. Good girl. You got one more? No, good girl. Good job. Good girl. Good girl. Okay. Damn. Damn. Let me do it. Okay. Penny's like, no, I have the high ground. Hey, down. Theo. Theo, no. Penny, come on. What? The Theo's like blocking Penny. Oh. That's, that's not down. That's more up. That's more up. You silly. Silly. Oh, no. Ah. Ah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Big vicious wolf dog. Oh, no. She ate my hands. All right. Take down. Graceful. Graceful. Roof. Okay, okay. What were we doing? All right, killing Frenchmen. Oh no, this this cruiser. Oh no, she got some torpedoes off. 
Wow! That was an impressive threading of the needle. Very, very impressively missed. Alright, let's slow down. Um, the ocean is still out there, sinking though. Uh, the Galilee is right here. Hopefully they're shooting her. Uh, Pan Chow? You think you can hit her with a torpedo at 200 yards? She could hit you. Ah, oh, we did. Alright, that thing's not going home. Sufrin's getting it really bad as everybody passes by. Uh, again, let's try to get a torpedo into her. 1,200 yards is a low-speed torpedo, but she's basically not moving, so... Alright, good. Well, the invasion's off. We sank multiple French capital ships. Uh, amongst others. Escorts and whatnot, too. I'm pretty happy with that. If anything, it's time for the majority of my ships to start to retire from this. Try to get some of these groups of battleships together. Free dreadnoughts. I'll just tell them to get out of here. The transports have unloaded their men. So at this point, what happens to them doesn't matter. Prince technically hasn't sunk yet. She's been burning for a while. She's got she's getting absolutely blasted by everybody who passes by. Yeah, what we're gonna do is um I'm just gonna turn I'm gonna turn everybody north and just get out of here now. The the mission's complete. We sank a bunch of capital ships. So let's just speed up and tell everybody to leave. Uh, I don't think... I, did I tell the destroyers to... I don't know who's my lead. Oh, yeah. That's why the destroyers are milling about. I was like, did I tell them to stop attacking? I never told them to stop attacking. Did I remember... I don't remember. I don't remember if I remember. Did I remember to update Apex? I did. Nice. Yeah, good timing. There's, there's the sun. Oh... <laughs> Which one was this? Oh, it was just the super we're going by. It's fine. Update Apex is taking me a while. Yeah, I started. Um, I started it before before streaming. I couldn't remember if it if I I remember thinking I was going to do it, but I don't remember. I couldn't remember if I actually had done it. But yeah, oh no! Oh god! Just ran face first into a formation of enemy destroyers at night with like 16 pre dreadnoughts. And did not die. That was. That was a. I mean, we did good on the first invasion of Tonking. That was a much better battle. That was a far... Well, I mean, we actually got the invasion off, but it was also... I mean, I think we sank three? Four. I'm going to say four pre-dreadnoughts on that. Four capital ships. That's my guess. Oh, they found they found the empty transports. That's fine. They could sink ex post facto. It's not a big deal. They're just sitting ducks now. That's okay though. You just have to wait it out. Oh, stretch. Since the evasion was good as the place occupied, uh, what'll happen is there could there'll be a couple ticks, a few months, and basically it'll simulate land combat. Um, and, and then it'll tell me if my invasion fails or is successful. It could go either way. Miss Yes! Five! I got five that time!
five pre-dreadnoughts sunk. I lost two light cruisers, very old, very small, six destroyers, and only two of the transports, surprisingly. 12,000 victory points. Troops have landed. Parliament authorizes additional war loans. Studies of enemy ships in Texas have helped our research in light forces and torpedo warfare. Come on, France. Uh, blockaded. That means I've blockaded them. Because if I'm blocking... What? what? How are they blockaded? Unless it's just counting Southeast Asia for some reason? You need more destroyers? Yes, I do. Actually, we can work on that right now. Uh, open up my existing destroyer. Up it to six, uh, 700 tons. And... Add some torpedoes onto it. Perfect! Weight remaining zero. Give it a couple more torpedoes. And Zelkova! Two buttons, thank you very much. 15 months already. I'm still, still getting that sweet, sexy German technology. I'm mastering, uh, improved, uh, close to mastering improved turret designs. Heavy fighting and tonking. Enemy fortifications are holding up our advance. Rebellion in Southwest Africa continues. Uh, there's lots of merchants being sunk now. Latest designs for my destroyers are ready. Lay those down. Put a dozen of them in. We got three, four, and five months left on my light cruisers. Ten months on my battleships. Uh, no interviews without border changes or reparations. Nope, total victory. Friendly merchants sunk 13. So they've they've switched to raiding in Southeast Asia, is what they're doing. Okay, so ships in service. What we're gonna do is we're going to um we'll we'll do the same thing. We'll count we'll counter that in Southeast Asia. Coastal raid. What we got? No. Not worth it. Not gonna be able to get anything done. Well, I mean... If we can find some transports, it's fine. Coastal Raid just means I need to sink two ships. Yep, nope. Nope, warships galore. And they've got a cruiser, multiple cruisers in there. So we're just going to leave. Seems like we can outrun them, though. I'm winning so heavily, like, these tiny little battles, I don't even need I don't need them. I can win without them. I don't need to risk my- I don't need to risk my ships. Giving- you would just give them points. Don't need to risk it. Yeah, they had a heavy cruiser in there too. That would that would have destroyed us. First live stream I've seen in years. Well, welcome, welcome. Back that is. <laughs> they they won technically 147 points. Uh, coastal batteries in Hokkaido are done. Parliament just keeps throwing money at me. Steam turbines. Jesus Christ. Forces have taken control of French Tonkin! Woo! We actually got it this time. Do I want a soda? No, I'm good. White piece in three. No, white piece is fine right now because, oh my god, my merchants went fucking ham. Right, because I, uh, uh, most, no, that, well, some of it was the heavy cruiser. I put more heavy cruisers on it. 
Um, any possessions you take from invasion and a white piece you keep. Because a white piece is uh, status quo. It's where you are standing right now is yours. Last one I saw are, uh, was around the time your wife got a collection of Futurama in a Bender, a Futurama TVs in a Bender. Uh, she actually got me that about 10 years ago. I just keep it in my office, so I probably showed it off on a stream you were in. That's still behind me on my desk. Man, a lot's changed in the last couple of years, though. Invade something else? I surely can, and Hayate apparently wants you all to shut up. <laughs> Hayate's like, no talking. Uh, do I have the range? I don't think I have the range. Okay, it's telling me I do have the range. Oh, did you already open a soda and you're asking me if I want to finish it? I literally just opened it and told me not, but I don't mind also. Yeah, if you, when you're done with it, I'll take whatever you want. It, that does not look like I have the range for it, but I'll take it. Friendship intercepts uh, Chinese raider Enola. Well, I'll do a single combat. Enola's a good ship. She's new. So uh, let's see, let's see what. Oh, oh, that ship, that, that that's oh, 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 you're not getting away, friend. Ooh, hit with an eight-inch gun. Hit with a six-inch gun. Only making ten knots. I see you, Frenchy. As long as I don't get torpedoed, everything's fine. All right, she's slowed. She's barely moving. Getting hits. All right, she's dead in the water. Put a torpedo into her. Ah oh, man, these German torpedoes! <laughs> nice. Why won't you die? Why? Why are you making me hit you? All right, all right, she's not. Oh wait, 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 whoa, 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 whoa! We got another friend over here. Oh, big brother's coming to help. Oh, she hit us. Uh, what is she armed with? Four seven-inch guns. Ten. Si I'm. A I actually are outgun her. I actually outgun this ship, and I have more speed than her. We need to actually hit with those 8-inch guns, though. There we go. 8-inch hits. 6-inch hits. Uh, hit in the engine room, but no speed damage. She's got a 6-inch belt, but, I mean, we can penetrate that. There we go. Two hits with the 8-inch guns. Three hits with the 8-inch guns. All, well, I say all four, but we've got six eight inch, eight inch. That's a lot of hits, though. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Oh, she's on fire. Oh, oh, oh that looks like a raging inferno. She's still firing back. But that looks like a raging inferno. Keep keep her under fire. It, it, it um, negatively impacts firefighting ability. I gotta say, the Enola is doing really... 42 primary hits and 43 secondary hits. That is... That is good. That is good. New war, the same one. This is the same war if you're, uh, as, uh, as it uh, pertains to the French. It's only my second war in the game so far. First one, um, a victory against the Japanese. I run out of ammo killing you. This is a definite victory against France. All right, Enola, she's only making about 10 knots now, so hit her with a torpedo. All right, try that again. Hit her with a torpedo. Well, let's get in, I don't wanna get in closer. She has torpedoes too. Oh, come on. I'm not convinced. Oh, no, she sank. Never mind. we're good. Wow, that went well. I took out two French raiders there. 
And got a thousand victory points. Uh, when our ship... Oh, our new light cruiser commissioned to the Navy during trials. It's found that the ship has trouble reaching her design speed. No! She's fat! I'm going to be sunk. Five. Oh no, my new light cruisers are coming in chunky. Ah, damn it. Oh, it's another invasion battle. They barely have anything left. They declined the invasion battle. Oh, elderly Bach, welcome. With no interference from the French Navy. Convoy attack battle in support of land combat. Okay, so they're, they they decline. Oh, we all we got is destroyers here. Okay, so I'll just retire from this. They decline to even contest the landings. Not gonna bother f uh, fighting uh, destroyer actions. What is this game? This is called Rule the Waves Two. It is a naval combat simulator ranging from 1900 to around 1950. I'm currently playing as China, which is the worst start in the game. And we are fighting France, attempting to take control of all of France's old, um, uh, old Chinese colonies and French Indochina. Jeff Bezos is stepping down as Amazon CEO. Oh no, whatever will we do? Uh, and I'm currently kick unexpected advances in turret and gun mount. Oh, okay, this could be good. Come on, triple turrets. I think it's a little early for triple turrets. Uh, it's just a 1% weight saving on turrets. That's okay still. Uh, let's see. They sank two merchants. We sank 11 merchants in the raiding that month. Six months till our American-built battleships are done. Still, I still can't believe that America's got access to 14-inch guns so early. Still amaz it still amazes me. How many pre-dreadnoughts do they have left? Two! Wait, no. Those are battleships. Ten! Still, a lot less than they had before. A lot less than they had before. Oh, man. Oh, I, I sank a fuck ton of them. Because they had almost 300,000 tons of pre-dreadnoughts. Now they're down to 151. Now they're down to 151. Uh, okay. I think I think we just stay the course now and keep just rolling down French Indochina and waiting for France to surrender. French ship intercepts a Chinese raider in Northern Europe. I'm just gonna auto resolve that. Those, I, I sent my oldest, slowest ships to go raid the coast around uh, Europe. I'm just gonna auto resolve it. If they sink, doesn't matter. Ship sunk by an enemy. Yeah, it was it was it was an old slow light cruiser sunk by an armored cruiser, and and man, the, the Dowager Empress just keeps throwing money at me. Main battery wing turrets too. Woo! And explosive shell and uh, increased damage on explosive shells. Oh my God, Germany! I got a tech sharing agreement with Germany, and it is proving successful. Heard about Wall Street bets using stocks on GameStop. Oh yeah, the entire planet's heard about that. Everybody knows about that. Uh, battle in support of land combat? Sure, why not? Oh, all I got is my crappy old light cruisers. Again, we'll do the same thing. See if we can find some transports. But not actually... No, no, those aren't transports. Not engage their uh, their their military with my my shitty old cruisers. And I'm winning so heavily. I will I will give some easy easy to hit uh, merchant ships, but I'm not going to bother attacking their uh, attacking with my shitty old cruisers. So back to port and the mission. They had armored cruisers there. Wasn't gonna beat them. But my new light cruisers are starting to commission, which is good. Army wants more resources. I got this. Only the Navy can win this war. I got this. 17 more merchants sunk. My, my raiders are doing amazing. We got a lot. Oh my god. My budget is just so good right now. 
I, I'm still, okay. I'm still probably the poorest nation in the world. I, 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 I've I got 326 million, um, dollars per year. I think that's millions uh, of dollars per year to use. That, that outdoes Japan, but Japan's not at war right now. So cut that down by about a third uh, to account for wartime expenditure on par with Japan. How old is this game? <laughs> I don't know, 18 months? It's, re it's relatively new. Um, I got a lot of fucking money. I feel like what's gonna happen, my monthly balance is hugely in the positive. I feel like what's gonna happen is that I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to the US and ask them for, um, either some new, for a new battleship or a, um, you know what? I can build my own decent sized battleship if I wait a month. When did the game first come out? That's what I, what I said. It's like 18 months old. It's not that old. Two years? 18? I would say 18 months to two years old is how old it is. Convoy attack. Ooh, convoy attack. That's fun. Oh, but all I got is two... Le okay, are these at least new? No, they're not. They're old. I haven't moved the new ones here yet. I smell a dog fart. Why do I smell dog farts? <laughs> Who's farting in my office? All right, let's let's just uh, head for the transports and see if my light cruisers can do some damage. All right, so tell them to focus fire on the light on the the or yeah on the transports right in front of me. Okay, they're doing damage. Gotta sink a couple of them and I'll be happy. They're not they're not having a great time of it. <laughs> that, that light cruiser got a damaged rudder. She's stuck going in a circle. So I got one cruiser left to use. Um I'm gonna try to get at that AMC. Because those can be annoying. Oh, okay, we damaged her rudder too. And just see if we can't take out a couple transports. Because that'll make me happy. Yeah, there we go. Yeah! Okay, they scattered. I'm running out of ammo. We've sunk a, a number of them. Try to finish off the AMC. Alright, hit her a bunch of times. She's on fire. All right, this cruiser is, uh, they, they took advantage of the situation and hit her a number of times. Five medium hits, five light hits, only making 12 of 21 knots. So try to get her out of here and have the other one chase down the rest of the merchants and then just call it a day. Might run out of ammo before sinking all of them. Take out that destroyer. Oh, damn it! I was like, we'll take out that destroyer, no problem. She got a torpedo into us. Oh, wait, no, 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 that was the other one. Ah, she's serving as a great distraction. Oh, shit! Whoops! My bad. My, my bad. My bad, sorry, sorry. Well, when you run out of ammo, I think we are out of ammo. Yeah, the forward gun's completely out. All right, all right, I'm 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 just gonna leave now. I'm just gonna see if, I'm just gonna see if we can get out of here now. I don't know if it, either of these cruisers are gonna survive this battle. Um, I just wanted to sink as many transports as possible. Honestly, at this point, I'm just trying to wrap up the war. Trying to avoid losses, get easy points where I can. At least the French are terrible gunners. They're not They're not landing anything. I, I'm completely out of ammo. Yeah, 
Yeah, they're just chasing me up the coastline here. It's it's a long way to the nearest friendly port. Uh, when's the sun go down? Three. Okay, we're gonna probably have to wait three hours till the sun goes down to lose them in the uh, lose them in the darkness. I'm only going 18 knots right now. We're not gonna be able to outrun them. One hour, two hours. minutes as soon as the sun goes down we'll uh, wait till we lose sight and then um, change course and we'll get away oh, there's dusk and there is whoop nighttime oh my just one of my destroyers turned around and charged him for a sec I sank 13 of the 14 transports, and I just lost the one old light cruiser. I'll take it. Kind of a wash on victory points, but that's okay. New docks complete. Uh, new light cruisers are finished working. Are uh, starting to finish where the workings up. Sank 11 tran uh, merchants. They sank one. I can't believe France isn't ready to surrender yet. I mean, we're really kicking their ass. The new light cruisers are far improved than the old ones. They're supposed to be 24 knots, but they came in under Drunk Master Flex. Welcome, welcome. They came in um, uh, under the rated speed, unfortunately, but they've got eight six inch guns instead of two six inch guns, and then half a dozen five inch guns as a secondary. It's much better. No space for the good BBs now. Uh, we could probably build our own at this point. The ones we ordered from from the Americans are only three months away now. Another coastal raid. Again, um, it's only giving me these old light cruisers on these coastal raids. It's just not worth engaging with them. I, if I decline the battle, that just gives them points, but so I can't do that. So we'll just turn around, head back to port, and then it'll basically be a wash. We'll get like 150. That's not a big deal. Hey! Hey, whoa, whoa, hey, whoa! Back to port. One forty seven, yeah. Uh negotiated peace without border changes or reparations. The French keep asking for 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 no border changes, and I have to keep telling them no. Because uh, seeing of merchant ships by raiders and submarines are causing a fuel shortage in France. Oh my god, even my raiders are doing a number on them. Oh my god. France, just surrender. Stop making me hit you. We've been at war for two years, and I've devastated them. You know what I'm just going to do for now? Um, I'm going to lay down another four of those light cruisers that I, des I designed recently, because they're pretty good. Just lay down a couple more of them. And, um, and another half a run of destroyers. Oh, that was the wrong one. Shit. That's ah, fine. It's fine. It's fine. No, it's not fine. Scrap those. Those are the wrong ones. I got better ones. They have much better tor uh, torpedo launchers. I'm sorry. I don't, does it count as scrapping if the ship if it hasn't even started construction? Just erasing it on a um, on a page. Yeah, the 700 ton destroyers. Half a dozen of those. Just giving me this. Just giving me the same thing over and over and over again. These little tiny cruisers on coastal raids. Don't even bother with them. Head back to port. Don't engage. I'm winning handily. Stop having things to date. No, I mean I'm actively invading something right now. There's land combat going around all over uh, French Indochina. More seals. Yeah, when the when the new ones are are worked up, we'll send them over. I think two of them might be already. Complaining about low stockpiles of artillery ammo, general staff calls off the army offensive. Strikes and anti-war demonstrations are rumored in France. 
Okay, um, new light cruisers. You know what? They're all the Fredatos. Uh, wait, 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 what happened? What happened to this one? Why is this what? What the fuck happened to this one? It's brand fucking new. Why is it under repair for three months? Oh my god. My invasion target is set to none. I know, the invasion already succeeded. They're fighting right now. Well, let's move these guys to Southeast Asia. And I don't have the range to get to the next one down. Enemy coastal raid way up here. Enemy coastal raid. Hey, my new ships too. Right? No, uh, no. Wait, wait. Yeah, it is but two of my new ships. Okay, th these ones are better. I can fight with these ones. They have guns. Well, and I mean, this is a defensive battle too, so I guess we just hang out. Think invasion. No, the invasion hasn't failed yet. It would have told me if it did. It's still going on right now. I can show you in a sec. Uh, did the, I don't think the French- I don't think the French showed up to this battle. Alright, I'm going back to port then. I think that- I- that- they, they were- they were supposed to be attacking my coastline and they never showed up. Yeah. Yeah, end the scenario. Um... Where did they go? Oh, they- they- they went straight up north? Kind of missed everything, like threaded the needle on a couple merchants and whatnot, then just left. Oh, oh, the battleships! Oh, nice! Oh shit! Um, the new battleships surpass are, are surpassing their design speed, and improved accuracy from control tops. Heavy fighting in a knob, enemy fortifications are holding up our advance. Ten more merchants sunk. My first battleship has arrived! The Staris! And she was only rated for 20 knots, but made 21. That's beautiful. France, you, uh... Ready? They're building four battleships, but none are done yet. French ship intercepts Chinese raider. Auto-resolve. It's fine. Old raiders were sent to Europe to raid. Uh, negotiated peace with us getting disputed border areas and some colonies. Press for hard terms. Oh, they didn't... I actually was trying to get away from... <laughs> I was actually trying to get out of the war. I was like, yeah, don't tell them to keep going. Just say, we want you to surrender and it'll be done. Fuckers didn't surrender. Well, do I have better ships this time? Oh, yes, I do. Okay, okay. Now... I've got much heavier ships available to me. Now I could do a proper coastal raid. I've got a couple heavy ships here now. And a couple light ships as escort. All right, uh, up to 18 knots, please. All I see, I mean, they might have some pre-dreadnoughts elsewhere, but all I see right now is armored cruisers. The BB here? No, no, no. The BB would have deployed to um, Northeast Asia. She's got to finish her working up before I'll send her into combat. Oh, they do have some down there. That's okay. Gotta say, hell of a coastal raid. I haven't landed a hit yet, and I've been hit a number of times. All right, seven inch hit. Not, not a big, not a big deal. Uh, I'm going to order a flotilla attack on the destroyers. I think the French uh, accuracy is a little, a little higher today than I'm used to. All right, there they go. All right, they're going the wrong way. Hey, hey, oh, hey, hold on, hold on. Enemy transport over here, let's go get that. All right, uh, cancel the flotilla attack. And let's just try to head down this way and chase them down. 
We we landed a fair number of hits on the um, the French battleships while we were passing close by, but I still feel like they got the upper hand on me there. They did a lot more damage than we did. I don't want to take out their destroyers or maybe see if we can uh, take out their armored cruisers. Did we hit it? All right, we got it. Technically, they can um, end the bet. These guys can go back to port as long as they're in this little area, I'm pretty sure. But I, I want it. These guys don't have anywhere to go. I want to damage as many of these ships as I can. Uh, I'm going to slow down. Just keep, keep fucking up these destroyers and these armored cruisers. See if we can take a couple out. Ideally, again, the armored cruisers are the, the prize there. 11 inch hit on this guy. Oh, he slowed down to 10 knots. Can't believe they didn't surrender. I can't believe they didn't surrender. I'm rolling, I am just rolling over all of their Pacific holdings. Oh, they're trying to make a, they're trying to break out. All right, turn north. Shooter. All right, something sank. I don't know what it was. This thing's got to be 15, 15 knots, heavy or medium damage. The destroyer's getting blasted too. She's speed. I think she's trying to get to port. She's taking a lot of hits. Oh, three 11 inch hits. She's on fire. She's gonna, I think she's gonna make it back though. Fire a torpedo! I don't know if that hit! No, it missed! How is that thing still alive? How is it still alive? Oh no, she's gonna make it back to port! I know- Aw, oh, you- you son of a bitch! Oh, wait, wait! No, she- I don't know what the AI's doing! Keep her under fire! Another 11 inch hit. I'm wondering if we're over penetrating. It's a really close range. And um, and that's that's just an armored cruiser. An 11 inch shell would be pretty devastating against it if it detonated on the inside. We're hitting it with everything we got. Still always has light damage. 11 inch hit, 11 inch hit, 11 inch hit. There's more. There's more. Jesus Christ. Why won't you die? Stop making me hit you. I mean, we've won the battle at this point. All we had to do was sink two ships and we've sank a bunch of destroyers. Uh, one of my destroyers had a mine. That's not a big deal. I cannot believe how much damage this thing is tanking. Hit her with everything. Every caliber of gun in the in the fucking fleet is hitting that ship. Running out of ammo hitting that ship. Alright, now she's dead in the wall. Okay, now she's dead. Holy hell! I gotta say, I gotta give it to that little bastard. That that ship that ship gave me that ship made, made me earn it. That ship made me earn it. And then someone torpedoed her. A couple of times. Alright, alright. Sun's down, so let's get out of here. Hey! Hi, buddy. Alright, somebody's torpedoing it a lot. I think my destroyers are just having a field day now. Alright, there it goes. Holy crap! Oh my god. Oh, oh, you big boy. The official cat of the fleet. How you doing, buddy? Like, give me dinner. Commissar, buddy. Yeah, so they took out the cruiser, two destroyers, and a transport. I'll take it. Man, that fucking armored cruiser. Jesus Christ. There's the second battleship. Five new destroyers. 13 more merchants sunk. 
So the two battleships are still working up. But they're available if I need them. France. Convoy attack again. France declines. Cruiser action. France declines. Intelligence service is considering offering safe passage to a revolutionary of some renown to his home country of France. Yup, do it. Hey, Q ships. Cool. All right. Um, I'm not going to wait for the workings up on the other one. I'm sending, uh, I'm sending these two guys south to Southeast Asia. I'm sending the battleships in. How's the invasion? It's still fighting. Still, still fighting. Little swords there. Con another. Oh, 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 we actually. Oh, come on, battleships. Aw, oh, damn. No battleships. But I do get some of my new cruisers, so. My new cruisers are fully well capable of dealing with enemy. Tra uh, an enemy. Um, oh, no, 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 no. Whoop, 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 whoop. Those were <laughs> heavy cruisers. Nope and right out of that. I didn't even finish the sentence, which was supposed to be... Which was supposed to be they're fully well capable of dealing with the enemy transports and escorts. But, excuse me, um, I was completely outgunned there. All right, I had three light cruisers. They had four heavy cruisers, five light cruisers, and 11 destroyers. Completely outgunned there. The destroyers. Enemy sent out feelers through neutral nations about a negotiated peace without border changes. No! The French really think they're going to get out of this scot-free. They really think that that's going to happen. I still have a lot of money, too. Um... Honestly, I gotta use some of this. We need we 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 need to make our own battleships. I don't know I can't make that. That's not legal. That's legal. <laughs> Alright, I go up to twenty two thousand tons. I didn't think that was legal. Um Put on the torpedo put the torpedoes back on. I was like, there's no way that's legal. Apparently it is. Cross deck fire. I do not have cross deck fire available, I believe, right? Yeah, not research. So I can't do my own cross deck fire. But. The Germans do know how to do that. But do they have main caliber wing? Uh, no. Okay, so the Germans know how to do cross deck fire, but they do not know how to uh, mount main caliber wing turrets. So I think we are going to build this here. We're going to up the secondaries to six inch guns. I'm going to rate it for 20 knots. Maybe 21. 21 would keep it up with the other ones. How does cross deck fire without wing turrets work? Uh, smaller caliber guns. You can do it on, um, like, 8, 9 inch guns. Central firing is my best. Uh, put those torpedo tubes back on. Secondaries, I'll give extra armor to. Go up to 12 there, 3 there, 12 there, 2 there. I am going to run out of space for what I want on this thing. Ugh. So if I, if I give this ship everything I want on it, I'm 1,400 tons overweight. You're purring. Yeah, Binks is going nuts. He's so happy to be hanging out.
11 inches. Uh, do I have access to 11 inch guns? I do not. I do not have access to 11 inch guns. Uh... I can make those two turret singles, and that, that makes up most of the weight. Range. Uh, I, I do not want to make a short range Chinese battleship because China has two home zones, and you wouldn't be able to move between them, which is important. Um, huh. If I wait five months, I get bigger docks. Hopefully they don't take any money from me. God damn it, this is the only thing that's firing. I'm going to decline one of these. Friendship intercepts a Chinese raider. Auto resolve. Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. I was like, let's just wait a little while. The French government has collapsed in revolution. The French prime minister has been deposed. They've been forced to accept harsh peace terms. You could have surrendered ages ago. 20? 20? I've never seen that before. Holy shit. I have never seen that. 20. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah, I'll leave him Madagascar. Well, I have colonies to worry about now. Success. Jesus Success. Christ. Success. I tried giving the French an out multiple times. Multiple times. And they just wouldn't... They just, they just wouldn't accept it. They just wouldn't take it. I try to let them out. Got Bing's hair in my mouth now. Jesus Christ. It didn't have to go that way, France. It didn't have to go that way. But look at the coastline now. That's beautiful. I still need to, at some point I need to fight Germany, uh, Great Britain, and Russia still. Crush Japan. Unfortunately, Japan doesn't have anything to take. They don't have anything I can get, uh, worth, uh, because you can't take the home region. I don't have anything. But, uh, with about 25 minutes to spare, I think that's a good end time. I'm gonna wrap up the stream here because that end of the French War, I think, was absolutely perfect. I was really hoping to get that in before the end of the stream. Uh, and, uh, I am gonna go play, uh, Apex a little bit because Season 8 just came out. So we're gonna do that in a little bit. Uh, so thanks for watching, everybody. I will be back tomorrow, though, 2 p.m. Eastern here on Twitch to play the continuation of this. We have a lot to do. Uh, I'm a little bummed out that our new battleships um, never got uh, to see service, but they only, I mean, they were commissioned like three months before the, uh, the war ended anyway. So thanks for watching, everybody. I'll be back tomorrow, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.